Hello gamers and fake gamers alike. Welcome to another Epic Dusk Extravaganza Gaming Livestream Extraordinaire 2024 MLG National Championship of the World Series Mario Kart events. Look, it's Earthbound. What up, Stipey? What up, Dragoon? What up, Deep Sea? What up, Alex's Video Games and Long Plays? What up, Chow Cast? How we all doing today? We all doing good? We all hanging out? We vibing? We live, laugh, loving? How we all doing today, gamers? We doing good? We chilling? Oh yeah, Mario Kart. Mayonnaise Kart, let's go. What's up, Quinn? How we doing today? Welcome into the stream. What up, score buns? How we doing? Welcome, gamers. Welcome in, Epic Gamers. How are we doing? All he needs is a baseball bat and a red and blue hat. There we go. It's Earthbound. I'm ready to play some Mario Kart. I'm ready to Watch drive out. around a little bit. Crash. Oh ah. my god, we're kicking things off with a Twitch sub. Elsecaller16, 11 month uh, sub streak. Elsecaller, thank you so much. Appreciate you. Happy almost anniversary. You're playing some Splatoon? Yeah, I gotta play some Splatoon again soon. I've been talking about it. Maybe we'll do some Splatoon. Maybe we'll make a Splatoon channel. Should I make a Splatoon channel? I'm just gonna piss off Solder. I'm always talking about making new channels. It's my urge. I don't know what, what it is about me. I always want to start new projects. I want to start a new Animal Crossing Island, start a new YouTube channel, start a new this, start a new blog, start this, start that. But do I ever finish these projects? No. Also, I don't have Mario Kart. Well, then you keep staying on Splatoon. Hey Dusk, I'm back. Had to reset YouTube so I couldn't chat. Well, you're back now, Stutter King. That's all that matters. That's called the ADHD. Or is that ADHD? Maybe I do have ADHD. I don't know. I've never been officially diagnosed with anything, but I'm sure I'm sure I'm something. I'm sure I, I, I got something with me. But I've never been like officially diagnosed with anything. That said, I am working on a Sea of Thieves video right now from the stream that we did yesterday, and I'm kind of debating if I should put it on a second channel and just kind of like experiment with it. I don't know. I might. I might just have like a little hobby side channel. Where's my controller? Where, where, where the hell is my controller at? I just had it. There we go. What's up, Hilda? I responded to your message on Gilded about it. I don't think I saw your response. I saw Luna's response. Let me pull up the Gilded. I might as well. We got some time here. Anybody in chat right now trying to join? Or should we do, uh, should I go and do a public lobby for a little bit? I'll give you a, I'll, I'll respond to you, uh, when I'm done streaming, Dragoon. But for the gist of it, yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. I like Epic Dawn as like a second channel name. Epic Dusk and Epic Dawn. I kind of like that as a second name. I tagged you in a tweet last night. I I do have a Twitter. I, I just don't really check it. I could I could check the tweet that you tagged me in. What was uh what, what was it? Is it cringe, Stipey? Whenever you tell me you did something, I, I just I assume it's cringe. But you have to promise me it's not cringe. If you promise me that it's not cringe. I will look it up real quick. I got I got to find where Twitter is on my phone. Hang on one second. Do I not have Twitter installed on my phone? What the fuck? I don't recall deleting it. I literally don't have the Twitter app. What happened? Huh? That's strange. I'll pull up on my browser, I guess. I don't recall ever deleting Twitter. 
I know I don't use it, but I, I don't exactly like, I'm not like quitting it. Your sister killed your switch. Time to get a new sister. <laughs> well, I actually have two Twitters. Let me check which one you tagged. I think you tagged the, this one. I see that you uh, followed me. I don't see that you tagged me. I see somebody tagged me in March. In March. I, I never responded to it. Are, are you Eric XML? I saw somebody tag me in March. Elon phased into your phone and deleted it. Stifey, why am I looking at your profile on Twitter and I see at Geshen Impact, notice me please. Stifey, what are we doing? What are we doing? I'm about I'm about to roast your whole fucking timeline right now. Why are you why are you trying to get the attention of Gesh, Genshin Impact? Why do you repost things that say repost if you like Mudkip? Stifey, what are you doing? You and your siblings share a fucking Twitter? You realize they're free, right? You can make your own Twitter. You all don't have to be sharing and rationing out your tweets. <laughs> you know it's free. At least for now it is, and until Elon fucking changes it. Stifey, I gotta bully you harder. I really do. I gotta bully you just a little bit harder, Stifey. I do have my own Twitter. I just don't use it. Well, consider using it. The waifus won't respond to your tweets, my dude. All right, we got some people in the lobby here. We got a few people. I think we can go and start one up. I'll start one up, and we'll put we'll use bots to backfill, and then um, and then uh, we'll hopefully get more people joining in a bit. If y'all want to play and the race has already started, y'all can uh, still play, just so y'all know. You can just enter that room code on top of the screen. You got the game, Shendry? Yo, Shendry, join us! Join us for some Mario Kart, man. Hop in. Race some Mario with us. Jump on in, gamer. Your sub thing is now expired. Well, maybe somebody will give you another sub. Perhaps. Although you still have the emote, looks like, or at least one of them. My switch is charging. We'll charge it up. Let's go, gamers. Charge it up. Screw me for being poor. Nah, you're still you're you're cool, Hilda. Whether you're a sub or not, I still appreciate you being here, and you can still access the emotes with your Twitch channel points, which is kind of a cool feature on Twitch. What's going on, Karen Wright? Welcome into the stream. How you doing? Welcome in, gamer. Hopefully my audio's okay. Let me know if the game audio needs to be adjusted, y'all. Our first race of the night. Ooh, barely missed that green shot. Ooh, and the ricochet green shell hits Hilda, giving me the lead. That's why they call me Epic Dust. Soon to be Epic Dawn when I make a second channel. Oh my god, Else Caller is gifting a sub to Hilda. Else Caller, thank you so much for the gift to sub, buddy. I appreciate that very, very much, you epic ass gamer. There you go, Hilda. You're good for another month. You dodged the rapture for one more month. Did y'all ever see the TikTok that happened recently where uh, some lady was so convinced that the solar eclipse that just happened was the rapture? And she went in like, uh, went to a bunch of restaurants and tipped like thousands of dollars saying like, oh, I don't need the money once the rapture happens. Because she was convinced she was going to, you know, go up to heaven. 
And then when the solar eclipse happened, and it's surprise, surprise, it wasn't the rapture. She tried suing the restaurants for taking their money. Y'all see that? Or am I the only one I guess this kind of bullshit on my For You page? You saw that, Dragoon? It was so fucking weird. So cringe. My god. What are you doing? I forget people like that exist, man. Like, not to, I'm not, I'm not gonna make fun of like religious people. Like that's like if you, you know that's your thing. But like if you're so religious to the point where you genuinely believe that you're about to levitate up to heaven because of the solar eclipse, I, I, I gotta poke fun at that a little bit. I, I had a friend in high school who was so convinced that 2012 was gonna be the end of the world. They were they were so fucking like insanely convinced with that. It was it was cringe. And guess what? We're still here. My for you page is filled with cats and shit posts. Pretty much me, yeah. Cats and shit posts. I love TikTok cats, man. I, I follow like twelve cats on TikTok. Like the the accounts whose whose entire like premise is like being a cat. I follow um the uh, Max Maximum or Maxwell the Orange, um the Roly Poly cat, the one cat that just rolls down the stairs. Um, there's a bunch of cats I follow. I can't remember the names off the top of my head, but there's so many cat channels on TikTok. Goose on TikTok? Yeah! Bigger than Goose? I love Bigger Than Goose! Oh, I love that little fucker. He's cute. He got so big now! I remember watching those videos. And I think uh, the person who makes the videos, uh, she's doing like a follow-up, like, oh, Bigger Than Goose follow-up. Like, she's reshooting the videos that, that she did when he was a kitten. And now that he's an adult, like, seeing like how bigger he's gotten. He used to be smaller than a loaf of bread. Now he's about like one and a half bread loaves. I do follow Bapcat. Yeah, with the cards. I'm convinced that guy cheats though. I don't know. He's never shown us all the cards. He needs to start doing that. He, he needs to start like once the cat picks a card, he needs to show the other cards to prove that like they're not all the same thing. I, I, I'm skeptical of that, man. I'm skeptical. I want to see some proof. Show me your work. I don't believe this cat's actually picking these answers. I think you're picking the answers. And the cat's just picking random cards. I need to see the proof in the pudding. Renzor, the polydactyl cat? I don't think I've seen that one. I might not have seen that one. I'll have to look him up. I don't have TikTok, but that sounds about right for some people. No, for real though, really. I'm sure it's I'm sure it'll make its way to YouTube as well. Low guy equals big guy. Kind of think about. I don't think I've seen a bigger than goose video in a while on my for you page. I think when you stop interacting with them, TikTok stops showing you them. That's the fucking problem with like all these algorithms and shit and social media websites nowadays. Like just because I don't interact with the video doesn't mean I didn't enjoy it. It's just I don't I don't interact with every single video I come across. But if I if I scroll through like a couple videos without hitting a like button or something, TikTok's like, oh, this guy must not like this channel no more. Shout out to the people who say they hate TikToks, but they watch the content re-uploaded on YouTube Shorts. True though. I mean, it's fine. It's whatever. I don't like people. People can like what they like. There's very valid reasons not to like TikTok. Also, half the TikTok shit is just re-uploaded from, like, Reddit. I think everything originates from Reddit. Like, where, 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 is the, where does everything originate from? I think a lot of the TikTok stuff I see is, like, originally from Reddit. When can I join? Whenever you want, Stutter. Whenever you want. Uh, the room code is pinned to the top of the chat, so all you have to do is go to uh, on, uh, Online versus Friends, and then there'll be a place where you can enter our room code. And then pop in that code, and you can join us whenever you want. Yeah, exactly, Deep Sea. Just because you just because you see a video and you watch it doesn't mean that you want more of it. Yeah, Al algorithms like are, are are kind of like a necessary evil. I get that, but at the same time, I feel like these systems are not built for for people. 
Like, if I see a horrible rage baity video, like, it's human instinct. I'm going to watch the video. Like, if it's a video of a cop doing something they shouldn't be doing, like, it's just human instinct. I'm going to watch it. But because I watched it, the algorithm thinks, oh, this guy loves copaganda. And then they fucking flood my feed with it. It's so annoying. That's why, and I'll say it again, I know I say this every stream, but I'll say it again, I want to go back to niche form websites. I want to go on fucking seeathievesforms.com and only talk about Sea of Thieves on there. And not to worry about scrolling into some rage bait shit. Gonna watch my Am I the Asshole Minecraft video from Reddit uploaded five times on TikTok then move to YouTube Shorts. <laughs> You have to do some things and hopefully you can join. Yeah, for sure. We'll be going for a bit. We just started, so you got some time. Take care of whatever you got to take care of, and then uh, we'll get you in. It's kind of what Reddit is for. Reddit's for finding fucking hotties. That's where I met Solder. You want to bag yourself a hottie gamer girl? You got to go on Reddit. That's not even a bit. That's actually legitimately where I met Solder is on Reddit. If y'all can believe that. Oh, right into a box. Reddit re-upload. It makes so much sense now. I do like Reddit. I like that there's no character limits. Like, I understand for sites like Twitter why there would be a character limit, because, like, the whole the whole point of that was, like, short blurbs. Um, but I hate how, like, on TikTok comments, you don't you have a character limit. Like, I need, I need to yap for a minute, man. I, I, how can you have a conversation when you have to, like, condense it into, like, 100 characters? I thought I can get that banana. Dodge the blue shell. If you think about it, Reddit is basically just Discord, but all those subreddits are like public. They're not like hidden behind something, and they're searchable on, on YouTube or on Google. Y'all, be honest, how many times do you Google search something and add the word Reddit at the end of it? Because you want to hear real opinions, you don't want to see like bullshit sponsor posts. Hey, what's going on? Anything? Welcome in. What's going on, Aspen? All the time because Reddit search is terrible. <laughs> That's true. That is true. But you don't need it. You got, you got Google. I think Reddit knows. Reddit knows that you're just going to go on Google and search up whatever you're looking for, then add Reddit to the end of it. So they're not going to bother fixing their shit. Can anybody join? Yeah, agent. Uh, room code's on top of the chat. It's pinned on the very top, so just enter that room code, and you can feel free to join, man. We're playing with all the viewers today. Having a little multiplayer day. We just started, so the room's pretty empty. We only got, it uh, looks like, uh, four people here right now, so... Hop on in, agent. Hop on in. Join some races. Google's gone downhill since they added AI stuff. I can't look up images without getting AI AI shit. Yeah, it's kind of a, a, a bit of a problem right now. Y'all hear about that one game? Um, I forgot it's called Foam Stars for PlayStation. Apparently, uh, not only are they kind of ripping off Splatoon's idea, which you can argue like it's fine because like Splatoon doesn't own the rights to like a shooter game in, that involves like liquids on the floor, right? Um, 
but uh, they apparently also use AI generated art in their game, which is cringe. Yeah. Imagine you're, you're gonna charge me like sixty or seventy dollars for a video game, and you're using AI fucking chat GPT images, bro. Cringe. Luckily for PlayStation fans, they just got Sea of Thieves, so they got an actual video game on that on that console now. Thank God. What else were they playing? If you put minus AI at the end of your Google search, it helps. And if you want to avoid a certain website, you do the same for that site's name. Okay, that might be a solution, just temporarily, until Google cracks down on the AI bullshit. Good to know, Deep Sea, thank you. That's good to know. So, Dragoon, next time you're, you're trying to Google stuff, maybe check that out. Also, I see a SpongeBob me. It's so funny. I think that was the me someone told. Someone, so, someone was like, "Dust, get ready to see the best me ever." Was this SpongeBob? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, hey, it's the guy I randomly got gifted a membership to. What up, Boomy? It sure is. It's me, Epic Dusk. Yeah, you do, Dragoon. Yeah, you do use Spongebob. You gotta join so we can have two Spongebobs. Double Spongebob power. And we got Peter Griffin. We got, uh, I don't know who the hell that spider looking dude back there is. And then we got me and this other person. These are the only two normal looking me's. Hey, Lois, this is like the time I was playing Mario Kart with Epic Dusk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's jump back into it. Let's do another round. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Remember, if y'all want to join, room code's on top of the chat. Feel free to jump in the lobby. We got plenty of spots for peeps. You don't have the online version, so you just play the regular version? Well, we are playing online, unfortunately. You're in with me? Hell yeah, let's go. Let go! Karen, you in here too? Hell yeah. That's the chub, the me? That's me? It's a me, a Mario. I'm the me that looks like Frisk. Frisk is from uh, Undertale? Is that the guy, Undertale guy? Yeah. I know my video games. I'm a gamer. I know my video games. Mount Wario is a go-to choice. Dude, I want a Mount Wario. Ayo. You know what else is a go-to choice? Today's sponsor, HelloFresh. If you're an idiot like me who can't cook for shit, HelloFresh will send you a box of food that you can shovel into your face hole. Use code EPICDUSK for $1 off a $30 box. I feel like if I ever got a sponsorship like that, I would just make a really stupid ad like that, and I would send it to them for review, and they'd be like, no, never mind, we're canceling the deal. You're not taking this shit seriously. Hopping in next round, hell yeah, man, sounds good. Hey, that person just passed the blue shell to me. That's fucking rude. Mods ban that person. How dare they disrespect me in my own home? I'm gonna have to teach them a lesson. By running into the wall and very slowly making it back to the track. Lesson has been taught. 
Oh yeah, I'm, I'm teaching lessons all right. Come on, I was about to take the shortcut, man. I was about to take a shortcut. There you go, second place. I somehow managed to come back. There you go. Oh, we're back in this, I think. How the hell is this guy staying ahead of me? I got a star, man. Bro thinks he's queso mods ban. I've been saying mods ban this guy for way longer than that. I've been banning people since like 2000. When I started my channel, 2011. I've been banning people since 2011 when I started this YouTube channel. Queso stole that idea from me. I bet. I bet he was lurking in one of my streams one day, and he stole my idea. GG's gamers, GG's. Band joke's been around forever. I'm so rusty, been playing too much Mario Kart 7. Ah, but that game's dead now. You can't play it online no more. Unless you got pretendo. Unfortunately, I'm too much of an idiot to learn how to set up pretendo. Been trying to beat every cup, and Cheese Land's the one that you struggle with the most. Cheese Land's pretty hard, though. Cheese Land's pretty, pretty annoying. You're Iron Man. I thought that was Ronald McDonald. Big sad for Mario Kart 7. Yeah. 200 CC next. We could do a 200 CC. I'll do 200 CC once in a while, Bryce. I don't want to do it too much because I'm not that big of a fan of it. But I know some people prefer 200, so we'll, we'll, we'll sprinkle in a sprinkle in a 200 CC every couple every couple rounds or so. Hey, what up, EGZ? Also, I saw that typo. You're too late, Bryce. I already saw the typo. I already saw it. It's forever engraved in my memory. You will now forever be known as the guy who said 200 BC instead of 200 CC. Mod, screenshot that, print it out, put it on a t-shirt, make it merch. Let the world know. Oh god, 200cc! Oh god! I like 200cc. I don't love it. Like, I don't, I don't want to do it too much, but I like sprinkling it in. I wish we could do less than four races. I wish we could do like one race at a time, because it'd be fun to do like one race 200cc, and then one race do like wacky items. But we, you're, the minimum we can do is four. We have to do four races in a row. So if I do a, a, like a wacky item combination and ends up not being fun, we're stuck with it for, for three more races. Ooh, you son of a bitch. That was my triple mushroom. I was going to use that, and you fucking stole it from me. Very rude. Very uncool of you, boo. One of these days, I'll learn how to throw a green shell and actually connect it to somebody. One of these days. I just threw like 20 green shells at this Bryce guy, and they dodged every single one. This one, though, that's gonna get him right there. That's the one, baby. Oh, something god. Oh, and I 
stole first place at the finish line. Oh, you love to see it. Number one ranked. That's why, that's why I'm the number one ranked MLG Mario Kart gamer in the world. First person to say it right. Well, I already forgot how I said it, so hopefully I don't fuck it up later. Bro, I got so robbed. You did, man. I robbed your ass blind. File a police report, because I just fucking robbed you. What's going on, K-Bomb over on Twitch? How you doing? Welcome in. I have a VC on my Switch that hurts my soul. You might join after you eat? Yeah, join up. You got, you got time. Lobby's still not full yet. Joke's on you, I took your triple shrooms. All right, next race, here we go. When I connect, I call it Shell Shock. Classic TMNT save. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I remember when, we worked, when I worked at Domino's for a while, they did a promotion where you can order your pizza at Turtle Hut, and they would cut it into four big slices instead of eight. I don't think anybody actually asked for it that way, though. Like, I, I remember the promotion, I remember them telling us, like, hey, this is what Turtle Cut means, and anybody asked for it. I don't remember anybody actually asking us to cut it Turtle style. Wow, my game crashed. Typical Nintendo moments. You thought you can play a Nintendo game online without it crashing? Don't you know the Switch hardware runs on hopes and dreams? Oh god. Just woke up for a minute, wanted to say have a good stream slash day. Well, thank you, Stinky. Appreciate that. Very kind of you. I've been having kind of like a very, like, uh... I I've been productive today. I've been working on a video, um, and I made a short for... Uh, see of these and yeah I, I, i've had a pretty productive day but i still feel just kind of tired kind of, kind of a tired lazy day but i was very productive so we take those we take those dubs ow go go where where am i going Who's going? What are you talking about, Karen? Take a rest if needed without no epic without dust, so recharge. Exactly. Now I'll do this decent day. Working on a Sea of Thieves video, which I'm still debating if I should post on this channel, or I'm still kind of debating on starting a side channel for it. Either way, the video is coming out pretty good. It's coming out pretty funny. Pretty, pretty fun. Sea of Thieves really is a fun game. It, it honestly is. I love it a lot. I like being a pirate. I like going on wacky ass pirate adventures and doing shenanigans. I'm back, and I'm Metal Sonic. That's Metal Sonic? It does look kind of like Metal Sonic. You're right. 
I feel like I would do a perfect Sonic Adventure 1 slash Sonic Adventure 2 Eggman impression. I've been told, some people say I kind of sound like Alfred's Eggman from the fan dub. Which I don't think I'm at all deserving to be compared to the fan dub. I, I, the, the Sonic Adventure fan dub is like the holy grail of Sonic content. Anybody who thinks that my content's comparable, it's a huge compliment. Hey, this guy's got a block on his head. This guy got a block on his head. Get him. Oh, okay, well, I hit somebody. Wasn't who I was aiming for, but you know what? We take those. My favorite see at these moments we made a train out of the rowboat. Dragoon, have you seen any of the new update stuff? Because they added something that can be kind of used for the rowboats. They're um, in, in one of the future updates. It's not out yet, but they're adding this like conch shell that can like uh, shoot wind. And one of the things you can do with the wind conch shell is um, use it on a rowboat so you can make it like a little like a motorboat. One person can stand at the back and like blow the wind and the other person like steers. Make the rowboat like a little mi uh, mini uh, mini uh, boat. We gotta do it again, Dragon. We gotta do the whole rowboat thing again. That would be a really funny video. That would be a really funny thumbnail. We tied together 20 rowboats? We could totally do it now because of Saber Seas. Now that there's Saber Seas, we can do a little dick around stuff like that. And uh, not worry about other pirates. Yeah, maybe we can finally pull the galleon! Yeah, with the little motorboats! Exactly! Did you add your schedule to the uh, to the thing, Dragoon? Because I'm trying to figure out what time y'all are available for Sea of Thieves. I gotta try to like work it into my schedule. I'm probably not gonna do it too much uh, this month since we're doing our daily streams on this channel, and Sea of Thieves is more of like an off-stream game. But uh, once May rolls around, I want to start playing some more Sea of Thieves with y'all, since I'll have a couple off-stream days. Although I do kind of want to stream it again this weekend. They got a Golden Glory weekend up. I wouldn't mind. Uh, wouldn't mind doing another one. This weekend they got Golden Glory, so it's double XP, double gold. Catdog and I were, were talking about maybe even restarting our pirates again. Metal got robbed! You sold that game? You sold Sea of Thieves? Buy it again. Fuck them. Battle mode? I, I'm not a big fan of battle mode, Willy. If like, if at least three of you want want battle mode, I will do a battle mode. But I am not the biggest fan of battle mode, I'll be honest. Before we do a battle though, uh, somebody wanted to do a 200cc, so we're gonna do one 200cc round. I got you, Dragoon, that's fine, that's totally fine. We can play, we can play it week by week. That last mark. Oh, Animal Crossing? You sold Animal Crossing? Is the lobby full? Nope. You got some spots. Feel free to join us. Lobby's not full yet. The room code is pinned to the top of the chat, so feel free to just punch in that room code and join us. We just started uh, the next batch of races, but you can still join mid-session. Uh, mid right, does anybody even keep track of who wins and loses? I, I never keep track of who wins and loses during these. Who's the best Sonic character? Uh, Rouge the Bat. Next question. Any reason you guys pick the characters you do? I, I just like Isabella. Or Isabel. I just like Isabel. I like Animal Crossing, and uh, out of the three Animal Crossing characters that we have, um, I pick uh, I pick Isabel. 
says the winner. Agent, I'm not the best Mario Kart player in, uh, in our community. Um, there's a couple people who join the Mario Kart streams, and they kick my ass every single time. I might be winning now, but once one of those people show up, then I'm probably going to start losing. Like, I'm okay at Mario Kart. I'm, pre I'm pretty good at Mario Kart, I think, but I'm not, like, the best. And there's definitely people in the community who are a lot better than I am. Wait till Hoagie shows up. Hoagie doesn't show up at, uh, every stream, but once in a while when Sarja Hoagie joins, like, it's just fucking GG. Y'all might as well just hand in your fucking your trophies, because you ain't winning with Sarja Hoagies in the lobby. No way. No how. Or, uh, Dad Downey. Dad Downey's, like, a competitive Mario Kart player. They do the tournaments and stuff like that. They got the special jacket that Nintendo sends you for being a pro gamer. Yeah, there's some people in our community who specifically show up for our Mario Karts. Yeah, for sure. We got a couple people like that. 300? Nice, Solder. Congrats. Congratulations, Chuckler. Oh no, I hit a wall. No, not the wall. First place. Yippee. I think I'm in the right room. Well, if you see us, you're in the right room. If you don't, then you're in the wrong room. And if you see nothing but hallways, you're in the back rooms. And you're fucked. Nice knowing you. I'm in! One sec! Welcome in, Shadow. Welcome in. I'm the best. No, I'm the best. I'm the best. We're all the best. You love Mario Kart? I like it too. It's pretty fun. Pretty fun game to relax to. Mario Kart's like my go-to when I don't know what else to stream. I'm, I just like, when I'm like drawing a blank, like, okay, I don't know what I want to play today on stream, I just pick up Mario Kart. I've been having a lot of fun this month because we're doing daily streams for the entire month of April. And I am having a lot of fun. I'm not complaining. However, it is getting hard, like running out of, like I'm running out of ideas of what to do. My streams are usually like a challenge of some sort. I can't do a challenge 30 days straight. So I am having a lot of fun. I, I, love, I love the daily streams, but I don't think I would ever keep daily streams as like my regular go-to schedule. Unless I was a bit more organized and planning them out better. But this has been a really fun month. We've done a lot of variety content this month, and I'm glad that a lot of it's working out. We've been playing some Dead Rising, some Pikmin, some Luigi's Mansion. Uh, I did see a Thieves yesterday. We're doing a lot of variety content this month, and it's been a lot of fun. It's been pretty good exploring a little bit, exploring my horizons. gonna sneak in a first place, don't mind me. Oh, this guy got a fucking shock dodge! No way! This guy got a shock dodge! No! Well, not much you can do that, man. Shock dodge for the win. Hey, who stole my second place? Fucking Blue Yoshi stole my second place. Only play Mario Kart Tour, you have Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. 
Well, feel free to join us. You can't wait to join. You don't gotta wait, Shadow. Room code is pinned to the top of the chat. Feel free to join. The room code is pinned on top of the chat. It's first come, first serve. Whoever gets in first gets to play until they leave. Jump on in, gamers. Yo, is that the fish from Fortnite? Is that Freddy Fish? Is that Pajama Sam? Anybody played those games? Putt Putt, Pajama Sam, Freddy Fish? We're gonna play those one day on stream. I'm, I'm gonna get the collection on Steam. We're gonna play them all. That'll be our next special. Next time I do a month of daily streams, we're gonna play every single, like, humongous entertainment point and click game. It's time to mount Wario! Y'all, why is Wario kinda... kinda thick? Dragoon, which one's your favorite? Is it Pajama Sam? Which one's your favorite? I think Putt-Putt's my favorite. Putt-Putt's really cute. I do like Pajama Sam 2, though. Pajama Sam 2 was a really fun game. That, that one's the one that I, I remember the most. I don't know why, but that one just sticks out the most to me. Next team sale, I'm gonna buy them all. We're gonna play them. I'm not going to play it because I'm not very good at the game. You forgot how to play it. You, there's no skill entry requirements. You can be bad at the game and still play as long as you're having fun. Either way, it's up to you. If you don't want to play, I'm not going to force you, but I don't care if you're bad or good. Everybody's welcome. We don't have any uh, skill ceiling here. No, there's no skill requirement. My way, Bryce. Get the hell out of my way. This is my victory. I might get you, Bryce. Ooh, red shell, you're fucked. You're cooked. No, he has a protection banana. No! Bros had a has a protective banana. Womp womp. GG's. You didn't play the other ones, but Pajama Sam was one we played on the computer days at school. Yeah, I remember playing computer days at school. Going to the computer lab in school. Looks like you didn't. Well, I tried, Bryce. I tried my darndest. Too fast for the red shells. Way fast, cool. You're in shadow? It's nice. Sounds good. Sounds good. <laughs> Let's jump on in. DDD tier is me. Sounds good, man. Good luck to you. Best of luck to the races. I see a Rayman meme. I saw a Rayman. Those games were fun. I like I like uh, Rayman Origins and Legends. Those were the, the last two I played. I played a 3D platformer Rayman game for the N64. I forget what it was called, but um, I remember the cartridge was green. And they also had that same game on Dreamcast. Rayman's a fun franchise. Are they doing anything with it? Like, I, I know they had like an animated series where um, that looks like really like like funny. But are they doing any games with him, or is that franchise kind of dead?
You're spectating? Alright, K-Bomb, sounds good. Yo, I'm dodging everything right now. Let's go. I'd be dodging everything. Oh, not this stuff. Yeah, there's no dodge in that one. Can I join in 30 minutes? Yeah, as long as there's room. We're doing a first come, first serve basis, so if the lobby's full, you'll have to wait for somebody to leave. But uh, I don't think the lobby's getting full anytime soon, so if you got some time, feel free to join. I'll be I'll be around. can't have fun if I'm extremely bad because it'll make... Well, if you, if you don't want to play, you don't want to play, man. It's all good. If you don't want to play, you don't want to play. I'm not going to force you. Feel free to hang on in the stream. Did you ever play the Mavis Beacon Learn to Type games? No, I played Jumpstart Typing. That's how I learned how to type. It was uh, I, I played two different Jumpstart Typing games. Um, one at school and one that I, I got at home. And then Neopets also, believe it or not. Neopets has a Typing Terror minigame. And I played that game a lot. And I uh, that's, that's how I learned how to type. I learned to type from a very young age. I was typing like like at like a, like a professional level when I was like in elementary school. I, I was typing from a very early age. One of the benefits of being chronically online as a child. All right, I'm going to crank it back down to 150 CC. After these next four races, if y'all want to do a battle, I'll do a battle one. I don't like battles that much, but if at least like three people want battles, I'll do one for you guys. After these four races, though. Reader Rabbit sounds familiar. I don't quite remember it, though. I, I remember Reader Rabbit, though. That sounds familiar. Yeah, I had a bunch of Jumpstart. I had Jumpstart Math, Jumpstart uh, uh, Science... There was one with some board game that I had. What's going on, Super? How you doing? I'm doing pretty good. We're chilling. We're living. I love Kid Picks. Kid Picks was good. The oh no sound is like engraved in my head. That should be one of my alerts. The oh no. I love that sound so much. This chat is peak. Yeah, Twitch chat's popping off right now. I mean, Speed, you're watching the stream, man. I I, I, I don't know what your skill level is. You're you're watching the stream. You you get to you get to decide for yourself. Regardless, I don't care about skill issues, man. You you're bad or you're good. It's all good. No Jumpstart game will ever slap at the Cafeteria minigame in first grade. Cafeteria minigame? I, I don't know if I remember that one. I might remember it. I, I, I might remember it. You know what website is also slaps back in the day? And they're still around, by the way. They're still around to this day. Actually, no. I don't know if they're still around, if they're still around after Flash died. But uh, CoolMathGames.com. Anybody, anybody on Cool Math Games? Anybody remember that? Yeah, cool math games, dude. I love cool math games.
cool map games is goaded. Somebody on PC should go check real quick, see if they're still around. I know they were around recently, but uh, I, I don't know if the death of Flash killed them. I, I know Neopets brought back their Flash games via some emulator, so I, I know that Flash games can still survive. I don't know if Cool Math did that though. They are still there? Nice, that's fun. Would y'all want to do a stream one day? Coolmaths.com stream? That'd be a fun stream, honestly. That'd be a really fun, uh, fun stream. This might make some people mad, but I never found cool math games interesting. I mean, when you... I, I, I don't know how old you are, nor am I asking, so I don't want to know people's personal information like that. But when you're a kid playing cool map games, like, you don't really give a fuck. Like, you're just, you, you're happy to have whatever. You're happy to just be playing games at school. I don't think if I was, like, I don't think if I was getting into it nowadays, I, I care that much. But it's the nostalgia factor. I remember, like, playing it, like, in class when you're not supposed to be. You go to the computer lab, and it's like, okay, we gotta learn how to, like, do shit. And it's like, nope, I'm playing coolmapgames.com. You have it open on a separate tab, you have to like close it real quick when the teacher walks by to make sure you're staying on the assignment. That's, that, that's all part of the experience. Cool math game stream win. And then your computer freezes and you can't close the tab in time. And then you get sent to the fucking office because you're dicking around in class. Johnny Upgrade. I don't remember Johnny Upgrade. Hmm, do I join? Why not? Live a little. Hop on in. Join us for some shenanigans. It would require me playing the game I owned for years for the first time. You bought Mario Kart and you never played it? I'm surprised. Like for Switch owners, I feel like Mario Kart's like a very like it's the game to get on Switch. I think every every Switch owner has Mario Kart. I'm surprised you haven't played it yet, but you should play it, man. Make this your first day. Did you buy it and just like never want to play it, or did you get it bundled with the? Uh... Okay, yeah, you 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 got a bundle. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Oh no, you bought it when you got the OLED. Oh, I I thought maybe you got that bundle that has it pre-installed and just never played it. So wait, so let me get this straight. You you bought a, a Switch OLED for Mario Kart and then you you never you never played it. The reason why you got Switch is for Odyssey and the Forgotten Land. Oh, okay, I got you. Yeah, Mario Odyssey is such a fun game, man. I love Mario Odyssey. That game was really, really fun. Odyssey is one of the few modern games that I actually I actually have the desire to replay from time to time. I've done a couple replays of it. Most modern games on the Switch now, like, I don't ever want to replay because of how long the tutorials are. Like, Pikmin 4, or Breath of the Wild, or Tears of the Kingdom. Like, just such a long-ass tutorial that I just never want to replay those games. Mario Odyssey, I actually did replay a couple times, and it was it was a fun playthrough each time. Three red shells later, and I finally get ahead of Bryce. You've only beaten the game, but you're at 190 out of the things. Yeah, I, I 100 percent did it twice. I did 200 percent runs just for shits and giggles. I wish I was making YouTube videos back then. I would have loved to do some like Mario Odyssey challenge videos, like the impossible jumps and stuff like that. I wasn't really making videos back then. I was just streaming. Maybe one day when the content dies down, I want to try something new. Maybe I'll try doing those again. I could, I still could, yeah. 
I still could, but I, I got a lot of games that I'm making content for now, so I just don't really have much time for it, but maybe one day. When, uh, when I run out of ideas and I need something fresh to change things up. Honestly, Mario Odyssey just is a really chill game. Just, like, sit back and play. I'm a big fan of it. Can you beat Mario Kart uh, 8 only using Sonic? I'm forever linked to Sonic challenges now. I'm going to be making a Sea of Thieves channel and people are going to be in there. Hey, can you beat Sea of Thieves only using Sonic? Best me costume? I kind of like the little uh, power block costume. It's kind of cute. I don't really use a lot of the me stuff. Oh, you know what? No, the Pac-Man one. The Pac-Man me costume. I love Pac-Man shit. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the uh, with the Pac-Man me costume. Bros like Choctopus, the Sonic YouTuber. I've seen Choctopus's videos. Not if you hit on Knuckles' sister. Anybody use the Internet Archive for retro games at school? I know about I know about the Internet Archive. I didn't know you can use it for games. Wouldn't it be funny if Mario drove backwards and you- What if you were just driving to work and you saw Mario driving backwards? Just left to go change your cart. You don't have to leave to do that. You do. You can do it between races. You don't have to leave the lobby and give up your spot. Your favorite one is the Kirby one, but you're biased. I love Kirby games. Kirby games are a vibe. Have I tried Ape Escape? No, I haven't tried Ape Escape. I know it's a fun game though. It's one of those fun PlayStation games. Maybe one day I'll try it. It, it kind of fits my niche in my channel. I think my niche for the, for for YouTube is like old retro GameCube games, the PlayStation 2 games. It's sort of like my niche that I'm going for. Yeah, no, you you, you can do it, uh, Shendra. You press the uh, Y button when you're in the lobby before you uh, before you vote for the next map. Don't vote for the map first because then uh, you might get like kicked out of the screen and you'll pick the wrong car. Before you vote for the next map, uh, hit Y and then you can uh, reselect your character and car combo. You're fine though. I, I, don't, I don't mind if you leave the lobby and come back. It's no big deal. But it would suck if like you left and then somebody took your spot. Then you gotta wait for another person to leave to come back. Not that my Mario Kart streams get that crowded anyway. I think our lobby's still not even full right now. So you're, you're probably fine. But just for future reference, you don't need to uh, leave to do that. Kirby in the Forgotten Land's good. K bomb. I like it a lot. I played it. I played it on stream. Had a fun time with it. It was a very fun, enjoyable game. I don't know why they made DDD so fucking buff. Touchdown. First place. 
Kirby games always do that though, K-Bomb. Kirby games always have like a very, they're very easy games. And then like at the very end, they have like one really difficult part. I remember uh, the boss fight for Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland for the Game Boy Advance. And the final boss of that game gave me such a hard time. Yeah, the nightmare fight was hard as shit, and it was so long too. So if you died like like after ten minutes of it, you gotta start all the way back at the beginning. They didn't give you checkpoints, and it was right after the DD the DDD fight, right? And so like I I if I'm, I think I remember correctly. I I don't know if I'm misremembering, but I remember it was right after the first DDD fight, and I would always take damage during that first fight. So I'm going into the nightmare fight with less health because they don't give you full health for it. Unless you can do it, uh, you can beat DDD without without losing shit. This is your final race. Sounds good, Bryce. Sounds good. Nightmare in Dreamland was your first Kirby game. My first Kirby game was uh, Crystal Shards for the N sixty four. I like that game a lot. That game was really fun. We should play it. We should play it on stream. It's on Switch. I can easily stream it. I wouldn't need to bust out an emulator for it. Oh, for sure, Deep Sea. Older games, you, older games were a lot harder. They weren't afraid to pull punches. Or to not pull punches. Excuse me. I remember watching a video talking about difficulty in games over the years, and uh, somebody uh, pointed out that uh, there was some SNES game. I think it was The Lion King or something. I, 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 some popular, like, really difficult SNES game. And the developers admitted that they actually made the game so difficult because they didn't want people to rent the game from Blockbuster and be able to beat it. They wanted it to be hard so that in order for you to beat it, you have to buy it and, like, play it over the course of, like, months. That's kind of how, like, they used to do, like, like be play like like playtime in games it was tied to the difficulty the idea was if you make a hard game people are going to play it for longer because they want to beat it so they're going to play it for a lot longer than making an easy game you hopping off future all right i'll catch you later man get some rest dude get some rest have fun thank you for hanging out Which, in all honesty, that is such a base move. Like, you made your game difficult so kids couldn't beat it by renting it at Blockbuster. That is like a million IQ play, honestly. I kind of I kind of have to respect that, even though it's pretty degenerate. I have to respect that, man. I, I honestly do. On one hand, it makes the newer games hard, not as hard to beat. On the other, it lets them do dumb stuff like Star Dreams instant kill because I haven't watched the hundreds in the game. Yeah, get, uh, balancing out games these days is a little bit of a trickier situation. It also comes down to preference. Like at the, at the end of the day, I, I, I think everyone's entitled to their preferences. If you want a game that's incredibly easy and you don't want to like have to struggle to beat it, I think that's totally valid. Same thing if you want a difficult game that is a struggle to beat. I think that's also valid. I just wish that the developers would pick one, pick one lane and commit to that lane. It's okay to not appeal to every single gamer in the world, right? You can have a game that's just too hard for some people. What really sucks is when developers try to do both. They try to please both crowds by making the game super hard, but then making it easy at the same time. That's when like you, you fucked it up. Now, now nobody's happy. I'd rather you just pick an easy game or a hard game. That's like Guardian, uh, Garden of Bam Bam making extra long hallways so you run up the playtime. 
if the game's longer, you can't return it on Steam. Is that why they did that? Is that is that officially confirmed, Dragoon? I know some games, like, sometimes you'll go through, like, a really long hallway or a really long staircase, and what's happening behind the scenes is the game is loading the next room. It's basically a loading screen, but they wanted to feel seamless, so they make you walk down a long-ass hallway or something, or your character has to, like, crawl through a small space really slowly. Usually that's, like, just just basically an interactive, uh, interactive, uh, cutscene. Battle mode, please. Battle mode, please. All right, we'll do we'll do one battle mode. We'll do one one battle mode, and I'm gonna hate it. I'm gonna bitch the entire time, and y'all gonna listen to me bitch about it. Urgh, battle mode. Grr, blah, 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 blah. All right, all right. We'll do a battle mode. Do y'all want to do just like a variety random battle, or are we gonna do a specific one? I see one person saying Renegade. What do y'all think in chat? Should we do a uh, random, a random one? I'm, I'm kind of thinking random battle so we can get a nice little variety. Renegade or Shine Thief, random. People on Twitch are saying random. It looks like it's kind of a 50-50 split between random and Renegade. What's Renegade? Renegade is the uh, the cops versus robber ones. I'm gonna say let's do a random one, and then uh, later we can do one just just Renegade. Cause I, I like Renegade. Renegade's fun, but I kind of want I kind of want to do the bomb battle too. I want to do the bomb battle one. That one's my favorite. So let's do random. We'll do a random one, and then we can do Renegade. We can do a, a Renegade one later. Renegade, Renegade. Make that song. Urgent underpass. That's the Splatoon map. Yeah, I like the bomb one. The bomb one's fun. It's very satisfying, just like chucking a bomb across the map and landing somebody and beaming them from across the map. The bomb minigame is a lot of fun. I don't like the coin one. The coin one sucks. I hate coin collectors, whatever the hell they call it. Everything else is fun. Everything else is fun. But the, the, just the coin one, I can't stand. In Mario Kart 9, we should get five Pikmin driving a car. I would love for the next Mario Kart to include more Nintendo characters. Make it like Smash. Give give every character like their time like a, like their own special car and stuff like that. I would love that. You like hoarding bombs? It's so fun hoarding bombs. And like there's like ten seconds left, so you're just spamming the crap out of them. I love hoarding the bombs and just like unleashing hell. It's so fun. Oh boy, I shouldn't have said it was my least favorite because we got the coin one. All right, get it out of the way first, and then we'll we'll get some other ones. Dick took my coins. Bro took my coins with a feather. I tell myself I'll have streams on in the background while I work, but then I get invested in the chat. Oh no! I'm killing your productivity. Yeah, give me your fucking coins, Toad. Give me those coins. I just stole your lunch money. Here. 
Hey, that coin just disappeared from me. What the hell? Why are coins just disappearing from me? Are there invisible people taking them? Somebody got a boo or something? Stop stealing my money! Yeah. Nice try, boo. Oh, I barely dodged that bomb. Let's go. Pro gamer gameplay. God damn it! Alright, it's getting a little too hot in the middle there. I need to, I need to pull out. It's getting a little hot down there. Hey yo. Sorry, I said that's what she said. What up, Wolfie? If there was five Pikmin driving a car, that would be peak gaming. It certainly would be. I win! Wow! But what if it was five Pikmin in a trench coat? That's how they sneak into the R-rated movies. It's just, it's just five Pikmin in a trench coat. Yo, when is Pikmin 5 coming out? I'm ready for it. I know 4 kind of just came out, but... Bring me Pikmin 5. Yeah, they they could add. Uh, I, I think what they can do is they could add Captain Olimar's dolphin as a car, make like a, a, a dolphin themed car. Maybe the glider could be like five winged Pikmin flying. That could be cute. You know what I would love to see too in the arcade version of Mario Kart. Uh, every character gets their own exclusive item to use. I think that would be a really fun gimmick for the next Mario Kart because you know it's got to be a gimmick. They can't just make a new Mario Kart. You got to be like a new gimmick or something, right? I think that would be a good one, is uh, make it so that uh, each character has like their own special uh, item that only they get access to. So Double Dash? Well, Double Dash's gimmick was the whole two-character thing, right? Although, no, they, they did have a uh, design, right? Yeah, so kind of like Double Dash, just, except without the whole double-character thing. It would still be one character. Oh, I drove into that fucking bomb. Kellen, I'm sorry I knocked your ass out. I'm sorry.
I kind of spammed that fireball. Whoop. Couldn't have gone that one a little too early, I think. Ooh, Boomerang. I could do some damage with this. Ooh, I'm winning now. Ooh. Yo, I won! Let's go! Pro Gamer! Mario Kart with triple characters like the hero's bobsled? Oh, God. Mario Kart DS Balloon Battles, the best version. I played a lot of Mario Kart DS. When I was in high school, I used to take the bus, and I went to a magnet school, so it was like a really, it was kind of like, like an hour drive. And we'd all just play the DS on the bus. It was a fun time. Sorry, y'all. I had to talk to Sodder for some. Let's go, Renegade. 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 Gatorade. Powerade. Haterade. Lemonade. Am I a robber? I'm a robber? I'm a robber. Good. I was, I was born for a life of crime. You'll never take me alive, copper! Ha ha! They call me Epic Dust because... Fuck you. That's why they call me it. You'll never catch me alive, you fucking cops! Oh god. One of my favorite jokes I've gotten since I started watching these streams is saying something basically impossible is going to be on Switch too. Sonic Adventure 3 is gonna be on Switch 2 confirmed. Data miners have leaked it. I still low-key really want to start a rumor. I think it'd be so fun. If we all like work together on it, I think it'd be really fun. Oh, uh, once I go, sorry, some new my mic. Sorry, sorry, I had to say one last thing. I'm just saying, y'all, what if we all started a rumor? What if we said, like, Sonic Adventure 3... No, it has to be believable. It can't be Sonic Adventure 3. It has to be believable. It has to be, like, uh... I don't know. What would be a believable one? It's gotta be just believable enough. And we just lie about it. And we just... It's, we base it off of nothing. I'll make a fake Twitter, and I'll make some tweet, like, Hey, I work for Sega, and this has got leaked. No, it's gotta be something Sonic deep sea, because Sonic fans are fucking stupid. Sonic fans will eat that shit up.
We win! Epic winner! Sonic Labyrinth remake on Switch? Could be, could be. Let's not do Switch 2, because Switch 2 makes us sound fake. I think so Sonic Avenger port to Switch. That, that, that's realistic. Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 being ported to Switch. The next time they do... I, I keep throwing up this map by accident. The next time they do a uh, Nintendo, uh, Nintendo Direct, guys, whenever N Nintendo announces their next Direct, I'm going to make a fake Twitter, and I'm going to say that Sonic Adventure 2 gets leaked for Direct. And we're all going to spread it around like, like wildfire. That's believable enough. I, I think that's believ believable enough. It's the year of Shadow. They got the movie coming out. Sonic Adventure 2 for Switch. We're, I'm, I'm gonna do it. You know, I, I, I'm gonna get ready for it now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make, the, I'm gonna make the Twitter, uh, the Twitter account today, so that it's not a freshly made Twitter account. Cause that's kind of sus. I'll make, a, I'll make a fake Twitter today, and then when uh, the direct gets announced, I'm gonna make a post like, hey. Uh, here's what's happening for for uh for whatever, and then y'all got y'all have to share it too. Y'all have to share it, go crazy with it, and then people are gonna uh, other other YouTubers are gonna make make videos for it. It's gonna be funny. I would low key love Kirby Air Ride on Switch though, man. I love Kirby Air Ride. We should play that soon. Maybe that'll be tomorrow's stream. Y'all want to play some Kirby Air Ride? Kirby, 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 that's the name you should know. Kirby, 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 he's a star of the show. He's coming right back at ya. He's coming right back at ya. Yoink! I'll be taking that. Thank you very much. Okay, you are a fucking jackass. Oh, but you missed, Master Toad! You missed! You silly goose! You missed it! Oh, wow, that bomb got my ass. Yeah, for sure, definitely. I, I gotta make put some Sonic memes and stuff like that. Absolutely. I will. I will laugh so fucking hard if uh, anybody actually falls for that bait. And, I, and I, if, I, if I if I see a Sonic YouTuber making a video saying, "Oh, this very reputable leaker leaked this for Sonic," I'm, I'm gonna laugh my fucking ass off. Piranha Plant didn't do shit. Woo! Woo! How'd I survive that one? Let's go! Woo! I survived it! No! My fucking shrine! No! Give me my shit back, you bitch! Don't be stealing my property! This isn't Sea of Thieves! You can't just steal my shit! Yoink! Yeah, I stole that. I was almost home free! No! I was almost home free! No! Don't give it to William! He's so close to winning! Somebody take it from him! Steal it! 
I'll see you later, Wolfie. You have a good night. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you have a good rest of your day at work. why they call me epic dusk because i win every game i ever played i never lose dude shine thief is fun man shine thief is a lot of fun I think this next one's gonna be the bomb battle. Bomb battle, bomb battle, bomb battle. I'm max, that game's competitive. That game's chaotic and you're so competitive. That game is chaotic. Could it be Epic Dust, the successor to Drift King? You're right, Sonic. I haven't lost my virginity because I never lose. <laughs> That's funny. I'm going to use that. Now it's time for the bomb battle. This one's fun. Ooh, I got a two-for-one special just now. Ooh. How fun. Yo, I'm fucking going crazy this game. What is going on? I'm popping off right now. I probably shouldn't be going in the middle like that. That's probably not a good, good place. That you lose so many! God! I lose seven fucking points for dying? You lose so many fucking points when you die. I just died again. No, I lose my points again. I was doing so good at the beginning. I was popping off in the beginning, man. What is that? Alrighty. 
GG's. What up, Sincero? What up, gamer? Got greedy at the end. It's hard not to, man. It's hard not to get a little greedy towards the end. When they start giving out those uh, two bombs, and you start, like, chucking them. GG's, gamer. GG's. Full Renegade? Alright, we'll do one full Renegade, then we're gonna go back to races. We'll do one full Renegade, just for you guys. And then we'll do back to races. I'm gonna randomize teams. Wait a minute, how, how come sometimes it's like even, even teams and sometimes it's not? Alright, there we go. There are the teams. What up, miscellaneous? Miss racing with you guys? Yeah, we're chilling. Been a while since I've been on Mario Kart, but we're back now. We're hanging out. We're vibing. We're, we're chilling. Bruh, we got a bot. Unfair. Well, what do you want me to tell you? Maybe if more people wanted to play this mode. Wait, well, on, we have ten. Why is why is it not five and five? Oh no, we do have an odd number. We have eleven. We have 11, yeah, I, I didn't see the last guy voting. Luigi's Mansion. That's where I wanna be. Five Nights at Luigi's. That's where you wanna be. Five Nights at Luigi's Mansion. He's the GOAT. He was number one. Oh god, I gotta be a cop now? Whoa, dust don't get political. Ooh. Sir, pull over your vehicle. You were caught doing 60 FPS in a 30 FPS zone. You must pay the penalty. Yoink! Sheesh! There always seems to be a lot of cops around when you don't need them. Sir, pull over. You have been accused of spreading rumors on the internet as if they were true and making YouTube videos and capitalizing on the clicks. The fine is 69 days in jail, 420 days working at Taco Bell, serving me Baja Blast.
jail, more like jail, because that's where you're gonna end up after I catch you. For one special. These prisoners won't stay in their cell. What up, Sup Son? That's a name I haven't seen in a minute. How you doing, Sup Son? Good to see you, buddy. Koopa came in clutch. Good night, everybody. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Have a wonderful time. Of course the bot got caught. Been a while. I'm chilling. How's it been going? It's been going pretty good, sup, son. We're chilling. We're playing some games. We're doing some Mario Kart tonight. Having a grand old time. It's been a fun stream so far. Hope you've been doing good. It's good to see you again. Battle course, here we go. And we got Sup Sun taking over for the bot, looks like. Second round, Dodge the Law. I do that every day. Y'all know I'm a wanted felon. Y'all, if you heard, if I, if I was like a famous YouTuber, right, and like you heard in the news that I got arrested. What crime do you think I committed? I think for me, it'd be felony tax evasion. That seems like a type of crime that I would do. Chow abuse? Definitely abuses some chow. IRS wants to know your location. Good luck, IRS. You'll never take me alive. Oops. My brothers! Ooh, I got triple mushrooms. We're good, man. Got this now. Yeah, you thought you can camp the cell. You can't camp the cell in this game. Come on. You can't do that. These cars go too fast. Hey, Lane, you just fucking bananaed me. You just bananaed my ass and got my ass caught. Lane, you fuck. You sold me out to the cops. What, you took a plea deal? They're going to go easy on you because you threw me under the bus, you fucking rat. You ratted me out to the police? Mods banned this person.
Yeah, this is a, like, like a cops and robbers type game, yeah. You get points for, if you're a cop, you get points for every prisoner you catch. If you're a robber, you get points for every uh, teammate you free. Well, excuse me, princess. Rat! <laughs> I got ratted out. I forgot how bad the turning on my bike is. I like dodging the law. Me when I'm speeding, going 150. Nah, I don't speed. I'm a safe driver. Like a good neighbor, Epic Dusk is there. <gasps> Koopa Troopa, he's back! Epic got the bot this time. Good. I want him. I see how y'all play this game, right? I'm, I'm not happy to have a bot. Watch me. Watch how a pro gamer plays this game. Y'all aren't ready for me. Y'all aren't ready for my, my brand of Epic Gamer skill. Watch this. Zy fire? More like arrested fire. I'm gonna arrest this guy. Oh, okay. Well, somebody got him. Gotcha! Gotcha, Zyfire. Ow! Who put that button in front of me? I can catch him. Yeah, I got fire too, William. I got fire too. Koopa Troopa, you took my kill, man. That was my kill. Bro stole my points. I'm gonna camp the button like a pro. Okay, well, that's gonna fucking work. Gotcha, sup, son! Ha <laughs> ha! Snuck up on ya. Bro had no idea I was lurking from the shadows. Just waiting for my opportunity to strike. Though. Damn it, th I thought I got him. What? TV rot. I talked shit about the bot and he caught me. Erm, um, Shadow, we're playing Mario Kart right now. I don't know why you're talking about a Smash Arena. I don't think this is the place to be finding Smash players. 
Let's go free to commit more crimes. Dude, I love committing crimes. Crimes are my favorite. Never disrespect the bots. No, they can hear you, man. Just you guys wait till AI gets so powerful that the in-game bots can hear you talking shit. And they come after you. I'm criming! What up, Maggie? You guys know Maggie knows the person who invented crime? I swear they do hear us. They do. Dodge the law. My uncle invented crime. Y'all imagine like like what, what, what how did like how did crimes and like laws get invented? Like one day someone got pissed off and like shot a dude, and someone's like, yeah, they probably shouldn't be allowed to do that, right? That's probably not like good for society. We should like I don't know like ban that. How, how did the subject of crime come up to like like for the very first one? Someone goes into your shop and steals something. Hey, don't do that. Why not? Why, why can't I just take your shit? I don't know. It's a good point. They should probably invent something to make that illegal. I love the music on this track, man. The music on this track is great. Yeah, Splatoon music is really good. That new song they put out is really good. That, um... Uh, I forget what it's called, but that new Splatoon song... It's really good. Big dust open the cell. Just when I got back, the room is full. God damn it. I'm sorry, Hilda. I saw it open up soon. People come and go. I'm sure a spot will open up soon enough. I may want to take a little short break after this so I can eat some dinner. I don't know if Sato will take over for a race. I don't know if Sato will take over for a race. Don't don't hide don't hide your face from your laptop. You heard me. You heard me. Hey. Hey. Oh, I love this video. Oh, she's playing Star Dude. She's not gonna take over. Draw? Well fuck that! Run it back. I wanna hear the truth, the hot takes. What's it like really being the number one ranked Mario Kart player in the world? Gotta say, Maggie, uh, I gotta say, it's pr it's pretty uh, pretty exhausting. People are always coming up to me like, Oh my god, are you Epic Dust, the number one ranked Mario Kart player in the world? And I'm just like, yeah, I am, that's me. And they're like, oh shit, I'm your biggest fan. Redo! 
we'll go again. We'll, we'll, we'll do a, a, a batch of races real quick. But y'all, I got I gotta go to the bathroom quick. So let me go to the bathroom, make a quick snack. I'll be back in like five minutes. Quick, quick BRB. Solder's not gonna hang out with y'all because she hates you. Uh, quick BRB. Okay, gamers, I'm back. Y'all ready for some more Mario Kart goodness? Let's fucking do it. We should do blue shells versus shocks or something like that. Maybe. I don't know. I, I, I like the custom wacky items, but like doing it for four races in a row would really suck. The game kicked us out. What? But people are still here. Sounds like a skill issue. Speaking of skill issues, I cannot open up this fucking pack of crackers. What the fuck? Err, uh, what the flip? I can't get them open. Open it before the race, please. I want to eat them. There we go. Right at the last second, I got him open. I got these like Ritz cracker things, but they're using Cheetos cheese. And it's so brightly orange. No way this thing's real. It's good though. I don't care if it's battery acid. 
Lay it on me. Let's go, Mario Kart Wii maps. Yeah, they got a couple Mario Kart Wii maps on this. Let me know when the stream start. Oh, is that still on? That's kind of cringe. Oh no, cringe! Cringe! Bro, you posted cringe. You're going to lose subscriber. Boom. Get boomboxed. That's why you'll never be in Smash, Waluigi. Because you're doing shit like that. Three numbers between one and ten. Um, six, nine, and three. Six, nine, three. Hey guys, give me the last three digits on your credit card, and I'll randomize my Mario Kart track. Out of my way, lane. Lane? More like pick a different lane, because I'm winning in this one. Yo, Electrodome is such a good track. I love this thing. This is a good track. the room code i got went to get a snack then i got kicked no they kicked your ass out uh the room code is pinned to the top of the chat jelly it should be pinned on top of the chat there it's uh l q n c l but it should still be pinned on top of the twitch chat
thoughts on Shadow's voice for Sonic 3? I don't think I've seen it. I I, I know that like the something got leaked, but like I don't want to believe leaks. I, I know they showed a trailer at some convention, but they're gatekeeping it from us. I don't think I've heard the voice yet. I'm sure they'll pick a good one though. I'm per I, I'm pretty happy with all the voices in uh, the Sonic movies. I'm excited for the Knuckles show. The Knuckles show is coming out at the end of this month. We're gonna get to see some Knuckles. Here I come, rougher than, rougher than Knuckles, the best of them, tougher than Knuckles, you can call me Knuckles, unlike Sonic I don't chuckle, I'd rather flex my Knuckles, I'm hard as Knuckles, it ain't hard to Knuckles. If they don't fucking include that song in the series, I'm out. Oh, it did vanish from Twitch, Twitch tab. That's stupid and cringe, low key. Twitch, kind of cringe. Well, there you go. You got it. If anybody else needs it, I'll, I'll type it again, I guess. You know you're doing bad when you look back at the stream. Dusk is in the same part that you are. Rut row. Knuckles! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Give it your best shot! Oh no! Time for Moo Moo Meadows. It's time for Moo Moo Meadows. A sub son over here thinking that they're gonna win. Not today, buddy. Let me just uh, let me just boombox you real quick. Get you out of my way, so I can win this race. For I am Epic Dust, the king of all gamers. Bow before me in my Mario Kart skills. Watch as my piranha plant eats all your green shells before you even have a chance to throw them. That's just how good I am. Double mushroom power. Ain't no way I'm losing this one. Okay, well, you're a fucker. Oh, and Boo took my other mushroom! What a bitch! Thank you, Boo! Fuck you, too! Second place. Keanu Reeves is voicing Shadow? <laughs> Stop laughing. Is that for realsies? They should have had Chris Pratt do it. Hey Sonic, lasagnas, Monday, am I right? I don't think I believe you, K-Bomb. Let me Google this. Let me go on Google real quick. Let me see. Let me see what we're all talking about. Shadow voice. Sonic 3. Keanu Reeves joins Sonic 3 as Shadow. Really? Okay. I don't think I hate that. I think that's pretty good. I don't know. Keanu Reeves as Shadow. Hell yeah.
Did y'all see the link, the, the leaked sex scene between Shadow and Sonic in the movie? If you stay till after the credits, you'll see it. It's crazy. I think they're promoting the new Sonic X Shadow Generations video game. Now that's giving the people what they want, right? The people want gay sex. That's just the hottest new trend right now. You know what they say, if they ain't porkin', I ain't forkin' over my money to watch this movie. Wow, I'm okay, getting fucked right now. Fucking Funky Kong took my item box and then I get boomerang. Somehow end up in second place. I'm not I'm not complaining about that. I'll take a second place finish. Good race, gamers. Good race. Would y'all care if I go fill my water real quick? I don't know why I'm asking permission. I'm going to do it regardless, but uh, I'm just letting y'all know real quick. One more BRB. I, I got to refill my water. I forgot to do that. Okay, y'all. I'm back. I got my water. I'm hydrated. I also gotta Google something real quick. I need to know Deer Park is us Arrowhead. Yeah. It is. Arrowhead water and Deer Park is the same shit. That's why, that's why it tastes equally bad. Y'all, what's your go-to bottle of water brand? And don't be, like, fucking lame about it. Oh, Dusk, I drink tap water from the fucking forest because I don't want plastic bottle. I get it. Plastic is fucking cringe. I get it. But sometimes you gotta drink plastic water bottles. You're on a road trip or something, you need water. So that said, in this hypothetical scenario, which plastic, uh, which, uh, bottle of water is your favorite? I don't say Arrowhead, don't say Deer Park, or I will execute you on site. Deer Park! 
kill this guy! Sup, son, you should have never shown your face around here ever again. This guy's a fucking Deer Park drink. I was just saying the Deer Park sucks ass. They grind up the deer antlers and dust the water with it. That's why it tastes so dog shit. Mods, kill Supson. Aquafina? I like Aquafina. Shadow, uh, Shadow. Sawyer likes Aquafina. I, I called you Shadow. You're Shadow the Hedgehog now? <laughs> Anything but Dasani. No, I, no, Dasani, everyone hates Dasani. Dasani tastes, tastes like dirty coins. I like smart water. I don't like getting it because it's expensive, like, like, you know, whatever. But, like, I don't buy bottled water from the stores often anyway. So, if I am, like, on a road trip or something, I'll splurge for the smart water. I like it for two reasons. No, three reasons. One, I kind of like the flavor. The flavor's pretty good. Uh, two, I like how they have the sports little, the sports nipple bottle. I like that a lot. Arrowhead has that too, but it's not worth drinking Arrowhead. And three, the liter size bottles are still thin, so they fit comfortably in my hand. I hate when I buy like the big liter size Aquafina. It's like a giant like bottle. It doesn't fit in my cup holder. It doesn't really fit comfortably in my hand. Make it taller, not wider. I want that shit to fit in my cup holder still. Dollar General's brand water. Yeah, whenever, whenever I buy it from the grocery store, I'm always doing the store brand. I, I usually get the Aldi water. I usually get like the big, uh, the big gallon jug of the of the Aldi water. <laughs> Smart water, any pH water? Yeah, I don't really know what the fuck pH water is. Like, I'll be honest, but uh, I, I think I do like it because there's also that other brand, that one. Um, I forget what the name of the brand is, but they got like, the little plus sign on the bottles. And then 7-Eleven also has a brand of like pH water. It's kind of like smart water, and that's pretty good too. So I guess I guess it is. I don't know what the hell pH water is, but I, I like pH water. Call that the Pornhub water. Just semi fancy water. Yeah, pretty much. I like it though. It's good. I think I really care more about the bottle shape and the the nipple bottle. That's really all I really care about. It needs to fit in my cup holder. I don't want to just put it on the seat next to me. Watch it roll around when I hit when I hit the brakes and it falls on the floor. I can't taste the difference of any brand of water, and yet you choose Deer Park. So you have the magic, the magic taste palette that you just don't taste the difference of water, and you still choose the worst one. You're you're, you're keeping you're keeping them in business. You know that, right? Do you realize the power that you hold, Subson? Alkaline water. You got an alkaline tap at home. Nice. I tried a Brita filter when we first moved out in this apartment. Um, I don't know. I wasn't liking it. Like I, I, I use it for like uh, if I'm making like drink mixes or like cooking or whatever. Like that's fine. But like just drinking it out of the ta out of the, the filter. I don't know, Matt. But it just didn't taste that good. I know plastic water is kind of cringe, but I, I get the I get the big gallon sizes. So I'm not like I'm not buying the reusable single use bottles. You have to get used to it. I don't know because um, uh, my parents uh, in, in their old house they had like a it wasn't like a like a Brita but it was like some I don't know what brand it was but it was built into the faucet and uh, I drank I drank that water when I, whenever I was there and that water was fine that water tasted okay. They also had a, a, a like water cooler though with like bottled water which is weird I don't know why they did both but they're fucking boomers so they're just they're doing whatever. I 
I should probably experiment with some more filters and stuff like that, but they're kind of pricey. I don't want to, I don't want to like buy another water filter and then not like it. It's gonna kind of a waste. I think what I'll do eventually is get one of those water cooler dispenser things. Start getting the five gallon jugs. That way, I'm, instead of getting one gallon jugs, I'm getting five gallon jugs. So I'm using a little bit less plastic. And then you recycle those, you reuse them. This is a little more eco friendly. Sony makes your throat dry. You imagine being a water brand and you fucking make shit dry. It's the opposite of water. Is that Joe? Joe Mama? From the hit show Family Man? Hey Lois, it's like that time I played Mario Kart with Joe Swanson. Ooh, I'm in first place. Oh, I was in first place for a split second. For a split second, I got to enjoy that taste of sweet victory. Oh, boo, that wasn't very cool to you, buddy. Imagine missing that. Holy shit, you're bad. Imagine hitting a banana dust. Skill issue. Skill issues. I don't think it matters. I think Hilda had another banana. But still skill issues. Keep going for Rainbow. I, I, we still haven't gone this Rainbow Road. I keep, I keep forgetting to vote for it. We still haven't gone to play on this. Rainbow Road, finally. We get to play SNES Rainbow Road. Nice jump, lame. Nice jump. Imagine your name being lame, but you leave your lane to try taking a jump and you miss. And now I'm in first place. You fucked it up. That mistake is going to haunt you for the rest of your life. 20 years from now, you're going to be thinking, damn, I could have won this race if I didn't just take that jump. Why are you scaring me? Why is Sauter scaring me? Her cold ass hands. Why are your hands freezing? Why are your hands are so fucking cold? Are you dead? You are you a dead rising zombie? No, don't get. I like Sawyer's theme song. And now that she's up and not playing uh, Skyrim anymore, now she can 
take over for a race or two while I eat. That's how I get her, chat. That's how I fucking get her. All part of my master plan to finally eat dinner. First place. Get your character set up. Get out while you still can. All right, y'all. Sorry, I was gonna take over for y'all. Well, high roll circuit. I'm trying to. I'm telling them. Perfect. Boat high roll circuit, or I will be banning you. Jesus. Get the hell out yeah, of I woke you up last night by doing that. You're yeah, right. I'm not surprised. You got scared. You woke up and yelled at me. Yeah, I, I'm not surprised. I believe you. Din din time. You're a suckwonder. How are we doing, gamers? What are the vibes? Piranha plant slide? This isn't Hyrule Circuit. That's so crazy. That's so crazy that you guys voted for the wrong fucking thing. What's up, Shen? That's so crazy. Stifey, hello. Just got finished playing Stardew Valley with Peeps. So I couldn't uh, watch the stream earlier. But I want to pause it for like nine fucking people. Or six. Not really. Like, I want to pause it for everybody. Just so this suckler can go stand in the kitchen and look pretty. Yeah, oops. Oops. I did a fucking luck. I'm consistently getting fourth? Hell yeah. Bullshit! Who did that? Who did that lightning? Quick question. I just want to ask you a quick question. Have you enjoyed your time in this community? Yes or no? Yes or no? I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. Just noticed the name for the chow in the pink coat emoji is Potato. Best Mario Kart player in the world. That's because the chow is called- Yeah, yeah, yeah! That's the chow's name. Yes, yes, yes. Alright, I'll take it. 
I like the design of this level. It's like a reimagining of, the, of a classic Mario level. Don't hover around me. If I'm if I'm here, I'm here. I'm making my finger. Good for you. Don't hover around me. Bye. I love you. Bye. It's I love you. it's my time with Nobody the. Stop talking over me. It's my time with these suckers. <laughs> I love you. Not your time. Go. You're, you're a suck. Go. You can't kick me out. Go. We're doing 150 again. I'm the map pat of this channel now, finding out new lore. But hey, that's just a theory. A game theory. Thanks for watching. Um, I only see one person doing Hyrule Circuit. Interesting. Interesting. Just a quick question. Mm, why do you guys hate me? Who's the pumpkin one? Who's the pumpkin me? <gasps> Another person voted Hyrule Circuit. Give that one person mod. Who keeps getting these damn lightning strikes? No, literally. Insane amount of lightning strikes. Holy shit. Well, okay. I do like Chaco Mountain, but... Miscellaneous is, uh, uh, excuse me, miscellaneous is, um, the pumpkin, okay, pog. Pog, pog, pog. The little bats are so fucking cute. Oh, and I love the crystals. The crystals in this uh, little cave are so pretty. Yeah, I, I like this level. The map, however you want to call it. Why did that bat just ram into me? Hello? Why do you have a death sentence? Ooh, Lainey, that fucking sucks. Oh, you know what? <laughs> that sucks more, though. That sucks more, though. Okay. How is everybody- how is everybody able to ram the back of my car when I had a green shell right behind me? I don't understand. Um, quick question. Oh my god. The lightning strikes begin. Maybe the person that's doing lightning strikes is hacking. Maybe they're hacking this very specific lobby. Because they do this funny. God, what was that? Everybody's very goofed up on this map. Little piranhas also bite shells on the ground or objects on the ground. Fourth place, I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. What's the one thing you don't like about Mario Kart? For me, it's how they barely have characters from other IPs they own. Like we have Lucas and Smash, why not Mario Kart? I wish there was a more variety of characters. It seems like I get it. Oh, Sutter, it's called Mario Kart, so of course there's more Mario characters. I understand that, but I would like more characters that's not just Mario IP. Um, some of the items are really infuriating. The lightning is fucking infuriating. I really don't like it. EJ, you have a lovely day. We'll see you next time. We'll see you next time. 
I feel like uh, some maps there's like a lot of bottlenecking. And it just, I don't know, it just drives me crazy. Welcome back, Wolfie. They should do Nintendo Kart as a spin-off and focus mainly on making the, spa the Smash roster into a kart game. Interesting, interesting. Skill issues? Alright, I'll put the controller down and walk away. Yeah, and then you can come play while you eat dinner. <gasps> Hyrule Circuit! Imagine asking me to take over your stream so you can have dinner, and then you're gonna type in the chat, Oh, skill issues. Yeah, cringe. Cringe. I'll just turn the game off. Walk away. I'll go to bed. Fuck it, who cares? Husband issues. So embarrassing. So embarrassing. Damn, sixth place. Quinge. I was like third for most of it. Then I fell behind. Should definitely put Dusk in the timeout corner. She can have this channel. I'll just make a new one. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Call it Lame Dawn. That's embarrassing. Got my GameCube controller plugged in. Alright, since y'all got me Hyrule Circuit, what are, what are y'all wanting? Who's been voting for the same map over and over and over again, and they haven't gotten their map yet? Speak up. Average afternoon. That was some bad Mario Kart luck. I was sitting in first for two laps and then got fucked. Yeah, literally. The fact that you can be doing so well for the whole time and then just get fucked. Uh, I'll vote Coconut Mall because I like it. I don't know what y'all have been rooting for. Um, I don't play Mario Kart, but, um, skill issue? Skill issue? Mods, drop an anvil on that person.
Also, who the fuck said that Casio or whatever their name is stole that joke? Um, they stole it from me. Germa stole it from me, and then Casio stole it from Germa. So fucking jot that down. That's so embarrassing. For those of y'all that don't know, Germa's my brother. Banana placement was really nice. Good job, whoever did that. Wow! Was it worth it? Quick question. Was it worth it? Yes or no? Answer the question. Uh, orangutan, you are being banned after this race. I hope you're okay with that. second place. GG's, y'all. GG's. <laughs> Send his ass to the Shadow Realm! GG's, GG's, GG's. Alright, this suckler's back, so I'm passing the controller back to him. Bye, gamers. Enjoy the rest of gaming. What up, gamers? Yeah, I'm back. And I'm ready to play some games. Send his ass to the Shadow Realm. Tell your wife she's cool. You're cool. According to Wolfie. Y'all like having solder takeover times? So I can shovel food in my mouth. So y'all don't have to hear me go <laughs> while I'm eating. Definitely got that streamer energy. She's very streamer coded. She was talking to her sister yesterday because uh, I was helping Solder make a thumbnail for her latest video, and uh, her sister uh, she showed the thumbnail to her sister, and then her sister said, "I'm, I'm very Mr. Beast coded because I do good YouTube thumbnails." Mr. 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 Beast. Mr. 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 Beast. Streamer base and Twitch build. She has a Twitch, by the way. If y'all want to follow her, she has a Twitch. And she also is starting to make Stardew Valley uh, videos on YouTube. So if y'all want to check our latest video out, go give it a watch. Go show her some love. I don't know if she's gaming right now, but if she's not, she can post the link in chat. If not, I'll post it one when this race is over. She'll post it. Go check out her latest video, y'all. Go check her out. Show her some love. Get some views on her new video. Make her channel take off. I 
I'm very happy she's making videos now. I look forward to seeing her channel grow. And then we can compare numbers. Excuse me, coming through here. Don't mind me, just gonna throw this red shell at Lane, because Lane doesn't got protection. Ooh, sorry Lane. Ooh, so sorry. Oh, how will I sleep tonight knowing that I just did that to you? Oh, I don't know how I'm gonna recover from this mentally. I, I feel such guilt. I feel such immense guilt. Oh, nothing, nothing else I can do except just try to pick up the pieces and live day by day knowing that I won this race. Ooh, all that shit talking and Lane still wins the game. Yikes. All that shit talking and for what? Lane still wins! First time playing that map. Can't lie, don't like. Oh really, you can't lie, Subsun? Cause you told me earlier that you drink Deer Park water and I'm starting to think that might have been a lie. No way there's a human out there drinking Deer Park water. That's hospital water. That's how that's how they say in business. When you got, when you're literally fucking bedridden and you can't you don't have any other options. And even then you can still door dash some, some like smart water or aquafina. Quinge! Oh no, you posted Quinge! You're going to lose subscriber! Let's go again! Yippee! More races! I wish I could post images in the YouTube chat. You can. You didn't know? Here, watch, I'll post an image. See? You could do images. Just like that. Subsun, join the Discord. Subsun should, I think uh, they're already on the Discord. Subsun's been around the community for a long time. I haven't seen them in a while, but they've been around for like, uh, since my Splatoon days, I think. Right, Subsun? You were, you were around for Splatoon days? I'm pretty sure that's when you joined the streams. Two truths, one lie. I drink the Sony, I play Mario Kart, and I have three bodies in the basement. Two maps in a row? New player bias. Oh, you joined during the Animal Crossing days, so 2020 then. You joined during the Animal Crossing era. Banana snipe! Nope, missed. Oh, y'all, watch this. Blinded banana snipe. Here we go. Yeah! Ooh, what if that landed on somebody? That would have been so good. Ooh. 
Whoops. Here we go. Time for a mushroom shortcut. Yeah. I am so talented at video games. Caesar wins. Oh, a shock dodge. Here we go. That's just what I need to get back in the race. Excuse me. Coming through. Epic Gamer make way. Wow. I Okay. Well, that was stupid. Time for the mushroom shortcut, misses the shortcut. True. Listen, I never said I was good at this game, alright? I'm more of a Sonic Adventure player, slash Sea of Thieves player, slash everything else I do. Pikmin, Dead Rising, Luigi's Mansion. You still have the first ever stream you joined in my liked videos? It might not be public anymore. I, I think I uh, I made a lot, a lot of my older streams not public. Unlisted, I think the word is. A while ago, but back back when I was getting into YouTube again, I was I was kind of cleaning up my channel, cleaning up some of the older, shittier videos. If it's unlisted, I can still see it. Feel free to try. Feel free to try. I don't know if I've unlisted them or if they're private. I think if it's unlisted, you can still see it. They, you just need you need the uh, the link to the video. If it's private, I don't think you can see it. I, I forget which I did. I know I didn't delete them because I, w I probably would want to like go back and like review those. But I was just cleaning up my channel. I think my channel looks really nice right now, like just the homepage, like the actual like channel page itself. I think I've organized it really nicely. I think it looks pretty professional. Into the trees we go. The maple tree is such a, such a vibe. Out of my way, Toad! Get the hell out of my way! A red shell for you. A red shell for you. Oh, you didn't want that red shell? Here, here's another one. Take another one. I got plenty to spare. There we go. Probably should have waited until after this part to use my power star. I still got you though. I still got you.
Oh. Ooh. Still got second. That was a close call, but we got him. Hey guys, I just got a text message that my MD state return was accepted. Guess what? I don't get to go to jail. I'm not going to jail after all. Huzzah! No jail time for lying on your taxes. I wonder how rare it is that you actually get audited. I wonder how like rare that actually happens. I don't know what I do. I don't like I I don't like make shit up like crazy, but like I do estimate things. Like when I'm doing the turbo tax stuff, they say, oh, you can estimate that, that's fine. So I do, but I feel like if they ever like called you, it's like, hey, you said you drove 20,000 miles. Is that real? If I wanted to post pics of animals that aren't mine in the Discord, should it be in Sucklers or just chat? No, you can put, you can put it in Sucklers, that's fine. Sucklers is for all animals. Any 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 cute animals? It doesn't have, it doesn't have to be your uh your animals. Any animals. As long as they're cute. A couple days ago, I forget who it was. Somebody posted like a really like weird one that was like a really like kind of like dirty matted looking dog. That was a little cringe. I don't know who posted it. I don't know if they're here or whatever. But like as long as they're cute, keep it keep it keep it lighthearted. Keep it fun. I don't want to see see stuff like that. But yeah, it doesn't, be, it doesn't be your pets, Deep Sea. Any creature is okay. <laughs> well, I, I didn't want to go into too many, like, details, but, like, yeah. It was, uh, yeah, that was kind of weird. Yeah, no problem, Deep Sea. If you ever think you're overthinking things and you want to ask to be sure, that's totally fine. I don't mind you asking. No harm in, no harm in double checking. I also tend to overthink things. I'll be like, hmm, I don't want to get banned from this server because I didn't dot my I's and cross my T's. I think you're fine. It's no, no worries. It wasn't even like, I, I don't think it was their pet, Wolfie. I think it was just a random picture they found online, but it's like, why? I don't want to sound like too mean, but some people online act really fucking weird. And I, I never understand it. Like, some people are just really strained online. They'll, they'll come in the stream and they'll say something super fucking weird. Like, not not, not like ban worthy. Not like I'm going to ban you because it's racist or something. But just like super weird. And it's like, why are you going online? Like, just like talking about like random, like, like this shit. Like, what are you doing? But that is not normal human behavior. Like, what are, what are we doing? Like, you log onto a Discord server, you see they have a pet channel, and you're like, Okay, cool, that's cool, pet channel. I like I like pets. I'm gonna go Google image search really fucking gross-looking dogs, and then I'm gonna post that there. Like, who does that? What's the thought process? I don't understand it. Okay, but like, that... that that was kind of like in context though, Wolfie. Like, it, we're, it's a Sonic channel. I say a lot of out of pocket shit like Dommy Mommy Rouge. That one's, I, I'm not as like whatever about that one, right? You are, no, 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 you are onto something, Wolfie. You fucking are. But like, 
I'm talking about like the the shit that's like completely fucking uncalled for, like completely out of left field. I don't want to say specific stuff because I know the people who said it might like be here. It's like I don't want to like call them out, like be whatever. But like sometimes I read a comment and then you'll hear this. And when you hear that noise, that's me muting my mic and telling Solder, look at this fucking person in chat. How do I respond to this? What am I supposed to say to that? <laughs> it was kind of funny, Deep Sea. No, it was. Let Wolfie cook! <laughs> Can we do team battle again? We can do a battle again if y'all want to do some more battles. We can do some battles again. Whoever threw that last lightning strike, I hope you stubbed your toe. Not the toes. I literally had a rando come into my Dark Souls stream accuse me of having played Dark Souls before, like, huh? That was really weird and uncalled for. Is it a crime to play Dark Souls before? Or did you title it like first time playing Dark Souls and then they said, oh, you're definitely not first time? At least that's more explainable. Like, I could tell that's just somebody who's chronically online. Like, all you do is go to Dark Souls streams and critique how they play. Like, at least that's explainable. Like, I understand where you're coming from. Like, you're fucking stupid and cringe. But, like, it's, the, the logic tracks. <laughs> I'm talking about the people. Like, I'll be like, oh, yeah, I'm drinking some Mountain Dew. And then they'll come in here and they'll be like, oh, yeah, my grandma once choked on, Mount on a Mountain Dew bottle cap. And it's like, hello? Like, what are we doing? Why are you randomly bringing that up? literally leaves you lost like literally like the, 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 the best ones where i'm looking at is like why the fuck did they even like come in and say that oh no you, you, no you know who's a good example you know what's a good example is the fucking the spider-man guy remember a couple weeks ago someone comes into the stream says hi how, how's it going i'm new here and then like five seconds later well i guess nobody cares about me web swings away like what the what the fuck are we doing <laughs> Why, why are we like doing the asterisk role play? Web swings away. Whoa. Um, you should have dodged right to dodge that enemy attack. Dude, I would fucking hate that so much. I don't think I'd be able to enjoy playing. I I was playing Sonic Frontiers the other day, and I was doing the Master Coco Hard Challenge, and every five seconds, people in chat, oh, you gotta do this move, oh, you gotta do that move, make sure you turn this on, it's like, shut up, let me figure it out, ah! Yeah, like, that family guy clip, like, who starts a conversation like that? I just shat, sat down. Literally, Caesar. Literally. I'll be like, I like Mountain Dew Baja Blast. And then they'll be like, oh yeah, that reminds me about Mountain Dew. Uh, I was on Google Images and I saw Sonic's sweaty feet and the sweat looks like Mountain Dew. Like, wh what the fuck is wrong with you? Like, I wish I could just slap somebody through the fucking monitor, man. 
<laughs> Alright, y'all wanna do a battle? Let's do a battle. Battle time, here we go. It's time for a battle. Battle time, battle time. Although we're gonna do Shine Thief this time. Let's do Shine Thief. All Shine Thief all the time. Here we go, y'all. Time for some Shine Thief. They want attention so bad. You better give it in a microsecond. They came in through shade and dip. Yeah, but that's that, that just sounds like a toxic person, Wolfie. That sounds like somebody they, they probably go you were probably their 20th Dark Soul stream on that day. That's probably what they do. They go to Dark Soul streams, roast the fucking player, and then like leave. A lot of Dark Soul players are like that. A lot of them are like are like that, like chronically online. You going, Subson? Subson, you have a wonderful night, man. Take care. Appreciate you being here. Appreciate seeing you again. <laughs> Lunch break is over. All right, Wolfie. Get back to work. Hope you have a good shift. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for chit-chatting. I'll probably go for another, like, hour or so, I think. Probably end the, end the stream around midnight. <laughs> Oh, I missed. Do oh, I missed? Someone just threw something at me. That wasn't very nice. You're not respecting the Sea of Thieves Pirates Code by respecting my voyage. God, this guy fucking dodged my ass. I just got fucking bamboozled by this guy. He's about to win. Bro's about to win off the. Oh, thank God, someone got him. No. Oh. Damn. GG's. Uwav won that one. They literally do, Deep Sea. They literally do. People do not know how to behave on the internet. Um, Sonic's feet remind me of COVID. Literally. Literally. All right, Shine Thief round two. Here we go.
Oh no, Rotten Hat stole our shoes. Yoink! That's mine! I'll be taking that, thank you so much! Watch this pro gamer move. Fuck no! The bomb got me! No! Gucci took my shine! I was about to do a pro gamer move, man! I have plans! I have plans for this shine! Yeah, Deep Sea, on Discord, weren't you talking about maybe doing content for cooking? I missed that. Fuck. Me missing that cost me the game. What up, Peachy? What up, Peachy? How we doing? That could be fun, Deep Sea. I like cooking channels. I like cooking TikToks. I don't know if you're on TikTok or not, but I love those like short form like cooking videos and they're very meme -y. There was this lady cooking with Linja. She used to make TikToks, but she unfortunately passed away, I think uh, last year. But her videos are so good. She did like cooking videos, but they're very meme -y, very like lots of jump cuts, lots of little jokes and bits. I love stuff like that, because even if I have no intention of, like, cooking the meal, watching the video is still really fun. Wow, I thought I had that. Baby, am I gonna hold on to this? Yeah, let's go! Oh, clean win! Yeah! That was close. That was close. Oh shit, we win! <laughs> Woo! Dude, I love Shine Thief, man. This is my favorite battle game. I, th I, th I thought it was the bomb one. No, this is more fun. This is more fun when I'm winning. <laughs> What's up, TJ? That'd be a fun video, but rip, rip to your microwave if that happens. Just let the, let the barcade. Nice. Hope you have fun. I want to go to a barcade. You know how with barcades, you know how they do, uh, they usually give you free arcade games and you pay for the drinks? You know what I want to see? 
I want the opposite. Free drinks, but you pay for the arcade games. And all the games are games like Dance Dance Revolution or VR games. That way, uh, you just see a bunch of drunk people playing those games and stumbling and falling. Low-key, watching somebody who's super shit-faced wasted play a VR game would actually be very funny content. Here we go again, gamers. You'll never catch me. never catch me alive, gamers! No! They caught me alive! How dare they? You won! Yeah, I see no crown on your head, because I don't have enough points to win. The battle mode points are a little bit weird. Like, uh, each battle... Like, like, you get points, like, during the battle mode. I think the more seconds you hold the shrine for is, like, the, the better. I think, like, winning off of one clean play probably isn't, like, as good. Yeah, Deep Sea, if you ever get started, man, let me know. I'll check out your channel. I think YouTube is really fun. Even if you don't plan on doing content creation full-time, like hashtag influencer. Uh, it's still a really fun activity. It's a fun hobby. Interesting to learn about. You're in here? I didn't see you sneak in, Rachi, since when? Thank God the lightning strike got somebody. I think I stole that. Over the rail bomb! Get him! Looks like Hilda wins. Hello, FNAF and Golden. Hello, Freddy Five Night. Welcome to my Five Nights at Freddy's Fazbear Pizzeria. Or, 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 or. Oh, look who gets the golden crown. It's me. Only me. Nobody else. I'm on top, baby. Let's go. Nobody else got 36 points. Just me. That's why I get the crown. Hell yeah. Look at me go. More Sunshine Thief. You want to do another one? Y'all want to do another Shine Thief? They're pretty, that was pretty fun. What's the word, y'all? Y'all want to do more Shine Thief? Or should we go back to races? Do it again? All right, let's run it back. Run it back. Run it back. I finally win. Oh my god. GG's, Hilda. You better do it again. Don't you hold a nerf gun at me.
More shine! More shine! Shine battle! Shine battle! Or what? Or I'll hold a hot dog at you. Oh, no, it's not a hot dog. It's a Baja Blast. Where, where's, where's the other one? Where's the other Dusk Emote? I don't see it. There it is. Bam. That's my response to your nerf gun. I see your nerf gun and raise you a cursed Baja Blast. Right, cat dog? Ah, oh, I know. We gotta play some more Sea of Thieves soon, cat dog. I might want to do it this weekend for Golden Glory. I'm working on the video from yesterday. I'm working on the video. Okay, I clearly tapped you with my mushroom. Why didn't I get the shine? That should have been me stealing that. That was, that was a little cringe. I didn't get that. Give me my fucking thing. Give me this goddamn thing. This is mine. This shrine is my proper path. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. That's what I thought. Get this blooper off. Yeah! Ooh, dude, using the feather to steal that shit's hard. Ah, I lose it immediately. I felt good though. Using a feather to steal that is really hard. Lightning Bolt? Get the fuck out of here with Lightning Bolt! No, fuck off! Why is there Lightning Bolt in this mode? I worked hard for my shine, man, and this is some jackass with a Lightning Bolt 20 miles away gets to take it away from me? My shine! Give it! This is mine! I earned this! I earned the right to this shine! Yeah! You thought your lightning was good enough to beat me? Epic Dusk? The best gamer who ever lived? Think again! Aw, oh, that sucks, Cat Dog. We'll play again. Oh, Cat Dog, though. We'll play again. I I'm getting back into Sea of Thieves, man. I'm getting back into it. I got the itch. I got the itch to play some Sea of Thieves. I don't think lightning was always in this mode, Deep Sea. I think that maybe they they pat, they added that in. I don't think it was always in this mode. I could turn it off too if y'all want to turn it off. I don't want to be too salty though. That sounds that sounds salty. Like, oh, you lost it to lightning, so now you want to take it away. You weren't complaining earlier when you fucking got lightning. Who is this imposter? Oh yeah, look, Rachie, you got a twin. You got a twin. Earned. Looks stolen to me. Earned. Stolen. Tomato. Tomato. The fact of the matter is, it's mine now. I earned the right to it. And anybody takes my shine, they're basically a hacker. That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking they're basically a hacker. 
understand. They need to be banned by Nintendo. Yoink! Oh, okay. A little bit too early. Yeah, the timing on stealing with a feather is really, really tight. Find this goddamn shine. I keep I keep going the wrong way. Yo, FNAF, me becoming a member. Sorry, we're, we're renewing their member. Two month membership. Thank you so much, buddy. Appreciate that. Welcome back to the Epic Gamer Club, my dude. Thank you so much for. Remembering. Come on, I should have got. W for now. Well, thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. Thank you for the membership. This is your least favorite map? Um, I think the, the... I don't know, which one... Let me look at them all real quick. Let me look at them all. I'll tell you what my least favorite is. I think Lunar Colony is my least favorite. I'm not a big fan of Lunar Colony. I like the theme of it. Like I, I like the space theme. Just the map itself I'm not really crazy about. Yeah, I, I think Nintendo knows that the battle modes aren't that popular, so they don't really care to add more stuff to them. But it'd be nice to do some uh, to get some battle tracks in the DLC. They could have given us given us a few. Here we go, once again, shine thief, gonna steal the shine. Ah, so close. Rachie's got it. Bro, missed the item block again. Yoink. 
You won't catch me on here. No! I could have gone on there. Would have been safe. No, I could have gone on my safety ledge. Hey, look, we got another Rachie here. You want to join the, uh, the the room codes on top of the screen if you want to uh, join the lobby. We got plenty of space left. In the uh, top of the chat, I have the room code pinned, so feel free just to punch in that room code and you can feel free to join us. No! Get the shine! Get it! Oh, damn it. He fell over the, over the ledge. No! Mine! I've earned this! I've earned this shine! Yes! I'm on my safety corner! Nobody can hurt me here! Yeah! What you guys gonna do? You ain't gonna do shit! Ha <laughs> I'm safe! Yeah! What you guys gonna do? No! Fuck! Someone got me off of it! That was almost gonna work! <laughs> it almost worked! No, don't copy my idea! Hey! Don't you copy my idea, you brat! That's the patented Epic Dust strategy. None of y'all can use that. I got the copyright on that. None of y'all can copy me. got too cocky i did get too cocky <laughs> i was doing it for the content i put it in hope i join you soon love your sonic videos well thank you i'm glad that you like them yeah you should be able to join next i, I don't think that the lobby's full as long as the lobby's not full it should put you right into the next one i think it should put you in the next one i'm not sure maybe it'll wait it'll wait till the four is done but i think it'll get you in here first more races? Yeah, we'll do some races after this, uh, Shendre. We'll, do, we'll go back to racing. People wanted to do some Shine Thief. I'm having fun. I like the Shine Thief. Shine Thief and uh, the Bomb one. Those are those are the fun ones. I don't care for the Cops and Robbers. I know a lot of you guys love the Cops and Robbers mode. I'm not the craziest about it, though. There I am. There you are. Now we got another Rachie here. We, oh, Rachel. I, is that Rachel or Rachie? I can't tell if that's an L or an I. We got Rachie and Rachel. Three, two, one, lit okay. Man, I could have gotten this too. Oh, I still got it. Oh, I'm still good. I still got it. Skill issues be damned. First, my lookalike me, now another Reiji? The stream's full of imposters. Ooh, and a clean green shell gets me the shine. That was a clean steal. Yeah, I'm faking you out. Yeah, I'm faking all you guys out. You all don't know where I'm going. Is he going this way? Is he going that way? Which way is he gonna go? Somebody stop him! He's crazy! He's going- he's doing laps around the candy canes! Watch out for bomb! Woo! That bomb almost got me. The bomb almost got me. Bro's getting too cocky again. Listen, you guys like it when I'm cocky, alright? Don't you guys enjoy this? Is this is not, is this not the content that you guys signed up for? 
GG's, gamers. We'll go back to some races now. We'll do some, uh, do some racing. Go back to 150cc. Yeah, go back to races. We need to take you down a peg. <laughs> Somebody kick Dust ass! Somebody get this guy! I couldn't reply because of intense battling, but it's an L in my name. Got you, Rachel. Got you. It was a spelling mistake that stuck as a username. Oh, nice. That's good. That's a good backstory. So we got Rachie on Twitch, Rachel on YouTube. And now I can tell you guys, I can tell you guys apart. Epic Dust caught splicing live streams in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Shine Thief mode. Yo, imagine getting caught cheating in Mario Kart. I love watching the videos on YouTube of like speedrunners who get caught cheating. They'll do like splicing stuff. I just watched a really interesting one about Mario 64 where they caught somebody uh, splicing their speedruns. And uh, the way they caught them was apparently like figuring out Mario's blinking animation works on some sort of a cycle. And so analyzing the video frame by frame, they were able to tell, hey, Mario's blinking animation is off sync, implying that you splice the gameplay. I think that's insane. That's like actual like crazy detective level work. Imagine holding a world record speedrun for like years and then like all of a sudden you get caught cheating because somebody like was like, oh yeah, you know what? Actually, the, this pixel here is just a little bit off and we caught you caught your ass in 4k I don't get the people who cheat in speedruns man I really don't like you realize if you get caught if you get caught cheating like your entire like career quote unquote is over like even if you like clean up your act and like stop cheating like everyone's gonna forever know you as the guy who cheated I guess it doesn't matter at the end of the day, like, plenty of people cheat and they, and they still have a platform, they still get watched, people will still defend them, but... Low-key kind of cringe. Kind of cringe behavior. What up, Fenwick? Welcome into the stream, how you doing? Welcome in. Get good, everybody. This lava map is cool. Yeah, I like this map. I like pretty much all the Mario Kart maps. There's only a couple that I would probably say I don't like, like Dolphin Shoals. I'm not a big fan of Dolphin Shoals. I don't really hate it, though. Like, I know I mean about hating it, but I don't hate it that badly. I think it's just the part, like, any level that's primarily underwater. I don't like the underwater levels. I feel slower driving underwater, and I don't play Mario Kart to go slow. I want to go fast. Ooh, steal it, Isabel. Steal it. Steal the win. Let's go. Oh, who did I just rob right there? Man, I robbed your ass. Who was that, Baby Bowser? Who was that guy? Pull up the name so I can see. Ova or UAV. Just finished watching you rating every. You don't have enough memory in the memory card. You don't have enough memory in the memory card. Is your memory card set correctly? That was funny. That was close. That was very close. It's wild when they're actually great at the game, but don't feel like putting the time and effort. So see, that that's the thing, like, people often, like, think of cheaters like, oh, you're so bad because, you know, you had to cheat. M most of the time, the people who get caught cheating in, like, any competitive environment, whether it be, like, a competitive game or whatever, they're usually pretty good at whatever it is they do. 
um and them being good is what allows them to cheat in a way that's harder to detect like a, like a like a really good mario speedrunner knows if they're, if they're gonna cheat you don't just splice the video because people can look at the audio file and see where you like where you split stuff um that said yeah it really sucks like when you're like when you're actually really good at the game and you just you, you can't get you you can't like uh get any better and you resort to cheating and stuff like that That's what makes it hard, because oftentimes the people that cheat at a high level, like, they're good at what they do. They're good at the game, they're good at the sport or whatever it is. So they know how to cheat in a way that's harder to get caught. They're not just sitting there using wall hacks, right? Except sometimes they do. Maybe not in every case. In some cases. In most cases, I would say. There's a really embarrassing video of um, a Counter-Strike tournament going on, like a live, in-person Counter-Strike tournament. And one of the players was using uh, hacks in the game, and one of the one of the referees, I guess, caught it and like had to go look at the computer. They they they, they paused the game and said, "Hey, we gotta look at your computer, see if you have any files on there." And the guy literally tried like swatting his hand away from the mouse and like covering his computer screen. It was so embarrassing. Like, bro, you got caught, caught red-handed 4K. Like, nothing you can do about that. This is a live in-person event, bro. They they can see your screen. How do you get caught that badly? That's so bad. Everybody save all save this conversation by the way. Everybody save this conversation. Somebody clip it. That way in 20 years when it gets caught that I got caught cheating in something. You can quote this and be like, oh, how the mighty have fallen. Epic dusk fell off. There's a Hollow Knight player who was really great, but used an invincibility mod to get a hitless Pantheon 5. Sorry, the uh, my monitor's blocking half your thing. A record. P5 hitless is a lot of work, but... It, but see, the, the, I, I'm not a Hollow Knight player, so I don't know the intricacies of it, but that sounds like something that's really hard to like hide. If you have an invincibility mod on, then you get hit, but you take no damage. Don't people see that? Gamma was going crazy in that. Warning, there's no memory card. Warning, your Dreamcast is about to explode. I'm the only Brit here. Shout out to the one Aussie. The one Aussie is Rachie. So we got Rachel and Rachie. Both of you guys happen to be from out of country. A person won a Mario Kart Wii match with tilt controls. I'm using tilt controls. You know, it's kind of funny because like uh, Mario Kart or Nintendo in general has like a reputation for having really shitty online games. Like their servers are never very good. But whenever we play Mario Kart, Mario Kart works no matter who we're playing with. We got somebody from from Australia. We got somebody from uh, Britain here. We got somebody from Canada, US, like all around the goddamn globe. And the lobby works like it, it maybe lags some time to time, but it's very much playable. Why can't Nintendo do this for all their online games? I'm gonna go watch the video of you ranking every damn in Shadow the Hedgehog. I gotta make another shitty tier of this video. I gotta make another one. That's my new shtick. The Sega CD warning. Uh, Sega CD... I don't think I remember that. I remember the PlayStation 2 one when like your memory card's like fucked up and like uh, you would turn on your PlayStation 2 and then like the, the music would go super dark and like 
the screen would go red as like warning your PlayStation memory card is formatted or something. But it was like so unnecessarily scary. my way, Rachy. Get the hell out of my way. I'm the streamer. That means I have to win the race. I don't win. Everybody's banned. Playing all the multiplayer games on my days of work. I see how it is. Una, I promise we are going to find a day to play some Sea of Thieves together that works with your work schedule. I promise. We're going to figure it out. Check our server. I, I put up a, a schedule channel so we can all see when, what, what days work for us. I definitely want to play some more Sea of Thieves. <laughs> yeah, true, Cincero. Older consoles, they had a lot more style to them. I think nowadays consoles are so generic and so bland and, you know, whatever. They're trying to be more like uh, more practical, but I miss the I miss like the old style of old consoles. Remember Xbox 360 had like the blades menu that was really cool. Or in GameCube, your memory card the, had like little pictures and icons of all the games that you saved. PlayStation 2 had the towers that got bigger the, the more uh, memory you devoted to the game. If I lose, I hit that banana. That's cringe. Bro, I'm gonna lose to that banana? Oh, God. Embarrassing. Embarrassing! You already put it down? Nice, Una. Yeah, we'll figure it out for sure. I was telling uh, Dragoon, I think, earlier that uh, I'm planning on doing more Sea of Thieves in May. Right now, I'm doing my daily streams for April, and I don't want to do too much Sea of Thieves because it doesn't, really, it doesn't really fit the vibe of this channel. And honestly, Sea of Thieves is one of those games I kind of prefer to play off stream anyway. So, uh, in May, I think we'll be doing a lot more Sea of Thieves together. Oh, okay, I got you, Deep Sea. I got you. Look up what happens when you put a Sega CD disc in a CD player. Let me look it up real quick. Sega CD disc in CD player. Sega CD data warning. Here we go. 43 seconds. The music is fucking weird. Is this... Am, am, am I... Press stop on your disc player now. Is this the right thing? Dude, the music is creepy. Please stop playing this. <laughs> or what? What are you gonna fucking do to me if I don't play this? What if they added like a screamer at the end of it? Like at the end of the thing, it's just like, take the CD out now. <laughs> Dude, that is creepy, man. That is creepy. Couldn't you, you didn't, weren't you used to be able to put like PlayStation games in a CD player and you would get like the, the soundtrack of the game? Am I making, am I making that up? Is that, is that not real? I could have sworn that, uh, that was a thing with old PlayStation games. You can put them in a CD player and you would get the soundtrack of the game. Or is that just fake news that I saw on TikTok one day and ran with it? Whoa, was that talking? It was the Sega CD warning sound that uh, Ra uh, Rachel was talking about.
I still think the PlayStation one is the scariest though. Ooh, and a shock dodge. Let's go, gamers. We got the shock dodge. Oh, shit. Unfortunately, not able to capitalize off of it. Womp womp. Third place. That's something that happens with a lot of game discs. They would get messed up if you played the game in a CD player, so they put this put this stuff as the first song. Oh, okay. That's interesting. I see a whole playlist. Game disc warnings that are creepy or funny. I'm gonna watch that later. GG's gamers, GG's. We'll go and get the next one going right away. Let's get it going. Clutch moment, Chad. This is a once in a lifetime moment. A particular disc error with the PS1 that would play disgusting sound dub personified fear. Personified fear, huh? That sounds fun. Let me look, let me look at that. PS1 Personified Fear. Why? Yeah, that's like the number one. Okay, here we go. PlayStation 1 Personified Fear HD. Yeah, that's pretty creepy. They do a really good job making it creepy because, like, it sounds familiar. Like, that's, like, what kind of what the normal startup sounds like. But, like, it's just off. And that, like, uncanniness is so much more creepy. Not a lot of people get that. A lot of people, when it comes to, like, scary stuff, they, they go too crazy. Like, jump scares or monsters. Like, uncanny is, like, the scariest thing. And it's, it's so hard to get right. I think uh, I think uncanniness is like the, is like the uh, like actually like the scariest thing in media, like stuff like the backrooms. But then like they'll, they'll they'll go too crazy with it. Like they'll do a, they'll do a backrooms vibe, but then they'll make like a monster chasing you. It's like no no no, the backrooms itself that was the scary thing. The monster chasing me that's just that that, that, that somehow makes it less scary. My soul just hit the Harlem Shake. Do the Harlem Shake. Have you got the Sonic CD song with the sound test? Is, it, is, that, is, it, is that the one with like the really scary looking Sonic? Like the really creepy looking one? I've seen it on, on the internet. I, I don't have it myself, but I've seen it on the internet. Is that real? I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know. What, is half of this shit even real or is it just internet stuff? You never know. I think that adds to the creepiness of it, though, because you don't know if something's real or, or like, fan-made. It's real. I'm gonna go on my game to check right now.
I win. You start with your Kakariko graveyard for Animal Crossing? Nice. Yeah, I want to see that. Animal Crossing when? Ugh. I don't know. I have so many games I want to get back into, Reiji. I don't know. I'm just one guy. I only have so much time to play so many things. Smooth first round. Is it rush hour? What up, Lucy? What up, Lucy? How you doing? I haven't played Animal Crossing in so long, I've gotten disheartened by everyone else's amazing islands. Yeah, I played Animal Crossing for a while back in 2020, and then I, I kind of go on again, off again with it sometimes. My profile picture is still my Animal Crossing guy. I still use, like, my Animal Crossing guy as sort of, like, my channel branding, but, uh, I wouldn't call myself an Animal Crossing YouTuber anymore. I want to get back into it, though, man. I, I kind of do, but I also want to get back into Sea of Thieves. I want to get back into, like, everything I've ever played. So many games, so many niches, so many contents, and I'm just one guy. It is real. Cool. Neat. Is this Switch or Wii U? This is for the Switch. The Wii U is unfortunately dead. No more, no more online for the Wii U. Um, Dust, what about pre -Kindle? Yeah, yeah. I'm good, how are you? Doing pretty good. We're chilling, playing some Mario Kart. It's been a fun stream so far. Nice turnout, nice conversations. No weirdos today. It's been a pretty good stream, I think. Good turnout, too, for a Mario Kart stream. We got about 30 people. Uh, that last time I checked, it was like 30 or 20 on YouTube. We got 22 on Twitch right now. Pretty good turnout for a Mario Kart stream. Sonic, I literally did the bit. Erm, Dusk, what about Pretendo? And you're literally doing the exact thing. I know about Pretendo, alright? But I'm not using Pretendo. Most people probably aren't using Pretendo. I know a few people are. If you're tech savvy and whatnot. But I don't... I, I don't got a Pretendo. I'm fucking stupid, alright? I don't know how to do that shit. I don't, even, I don't even have my Wii U anymore. Show me while I'm in the shortcut, you fucks. No! Make this just a second sooner! I could have done the mushroom and then got the banana to block the red shell. I could have maybe won that, but I got greedy. I could have played it safe and secured my second place. But I got greedy. I wanted a chance to win. The main character cheese didn't work. That could have worked. If I did it like a second earlier, I could have maybe gotten the shortcut with the mushroom, possibly overtaken first place, and then I would have had time for the banana to protect my, my back. 
imagine there was some sort of Sonic Battle Royale Emerald Hunt. There's that one Fall Guys type game that's been leaked. Um, it looks official. I don't want to talk about leaks as if they're official because you never know when they are. But um, it looks kind of official and it's like a Fall Guys uh, Sonic type game. And that looks kind of fun. I'd be down for some more multiplayer Sonic games. I'd be down for that. Opinion on Sonic Frontiers? I like it. It's, it's not better than Sonic Adventure. Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 are still my favorites, but I don't hate Sonic Frontiers. I had fun playing it. We, we, we finished it up last uh, last stream. Beat the DLC on hard mode, including Master Coco Challenge. Why is everybody wearing the blue jumpsuits? Because blue is a cool color. I'm pretty sure Rachie's is orange, unless she changed it. I think, the, I think the color of your jumpsuit is your whatever your favorite color is. When you're making your me, you can pick a favorite color. I think your jumpsuit whatever color that is. Yeah, there's been a Fall Guys collab with Sonic. But this is like a, a, a separate game. I think it's going to be a mobile game, though, which sucks. Like, Not to like say, oh, mobile games aren't real games, but like... Can we, can we put the games on a console or PC, please? I don't want to play games on my phone, okay? You thought everyone was doing a bit? Nah, nah. If, if, if everyone is blue, it's just a coincidence. I'm gonna make this. Yeah, like, I don't, I don't hate mobile games. Like, I'm not gonna be one of those guys that's like, oh, mobile games. That's not real games. Like, there are some really good games on mobile, but like, it's just, it's just not my preferred device to play games on. And I do feel like a lot of mobile games fall into that trap of like microtransactions and becoming gotcha type games, loot boxes, even Animal Crossing, like Animal Crossing Pocket Camp. It's a cute game, but the whole like fortune cookie loot box system, I, I just, I hate that shit. It really makes me not want to play the game. I'm just not interested in doing it, Sonic. I, 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 this is becoming the new. It's super easy to mod your 3DS meme. I think I think it's perfectly reasonable to expect that most people aren't gonna want to like do all that to play their Wii U games online. I think most people are just gonna wait for Nintendo to put it on Switch. And like I said, I, I don't even have my Wii U, man. So I definitely can't do it. Also, when it comes to stuff like that, when it comes to stuff like mods and stuff like that, everyone always says how easy it is, but then, like, you go on the forums or the Reddit, and it's, it's nothing but troubleshooting. Like, it's never as easy as people say it is. There's always, some, there's always a little bit of troubleshooting involved with it. Yeah, at the end of the, at the end of the day, Nintendo should be like preserving these games in the first place. It shouldn't even it shouldn't even require third parties. Like I'm happy I'm I'm happy about the uh, I'm happy about the, the the community still doing it. Like I'm happy that they're still they're still keeping it going. You create an Iron Man me and everyone in the game's going crazy. I saw an Iron Man today. I, I, I saw I saw an Iron Man uh, 
for me here. Check out my me suit for this next one. Are you are you using the me? I'll, I'll, I'll look at it when we're in the lobby. I, I don't think I saw it in, in the uh, starting line there. Whoops. I wouldn't be caught dead in a blue jumpsuit. <laughs> yeah, I know yours is always orange. I don't think you changed it. Barely made that jump. Probably would have been better to miss that though. I don't think it's stuck on the wall. And there goes my mushroom. I treasure my Nintendo games with legal emulators. Yeah, Nintendo really needs to get on the whole game preservation thing. It'd be so easy for them. Like, most people want to do things the legitimate way, not for a moral reason. Like, I don't think anybody has a problem with piracy, like, morally speaking. But, like, just for convenience. I think most people would rather just buy the game on the console they already have. And then it's, it, it, it works. Like, it's just whatever, right? Like, I don't get why Nintendo doesn't just, like, release all their old games for modern consoles. Or even on PC, like the, the dream would be PC, like release all your old GameCube and N64 games and stuff on PC. I get that like a lot of the a lot of the newer consoles, like the Wii, has like their own little motion control gimmick, so maybe it's harder to do that. But I don't know, man. Release your old shit, Nintendo. Let people play it. And don't don't tell me, oh well Nintendo subscription service. No. Don't make it a subscription service. Don't make a Nintendo Online Plus where you're drip feeding the games to us slowly. Yeah, that's another thing, Legend. That's another thing to uh, bitch about Nintendo. The the whole uh, fear of missing out ex uh, exploit. You're talking about Mario 35. It was like a battle royale Mario game, and then they shut it. They shut it down. Yeah, I'm still alive for a bit. We're gonna go for like maybe 20 more minutes. So I'll, I'll end at midnight, like I've been doing lately. So we got 20 more minutes. We'll play. Yeah, I hate I hate FOMO. Like a lot of game companies are like abusing that now. They're trying to make players feel like, oh, if you don't do it now, you'll miss your chance. Like it, it's a huge, huge turnoff when you do things like having cosmetics in a store that like expire. There's no reason for these things to expire. Mario 35, like. It's not the best example because that's an online game and it, it cost Nintendo money to like keep it up and running. So you could argue that they just didn't want to do that anymore. Not the best example, but things like uh, the Mario 3, uh, 3D All-Stars collection, that is the best example I can get from Nintendo. There is no reason why they had to make that a limited run and make it only available on the online store temporarily. That was 100% you're abusing FOMO. You just want you want people to buy this shit now before they realize they're buying shitty ports that don't even work that well uh, on the on the Switch. What's the room code? It is pinned on top of the chat, Fanwick. Uh, LQMCL. If you need a reminder, it's pinned to the top of the chat. Yeah, Mario, the, the Mario All-Stars collection, that is probably the best example I can give. That was really scummy of Nintendo. There's no reason that had to be a limited time run. There's no legitimate reason for it. That's literally just some executives saying, hey, if we make this limited time runs, people will buy like multiple copies of it because it's, you know, it, it, they don't want to miss out. And that's extremely shitty.
Yeah, and all all of that it didn't even work because you can still find copies of it out in the wild. People didn't people didn't bu uh, buy into it. Thank God. You have it on cartridge. Thought it'd be worth money, but no. Yeah, nah, it was stupid. There's no reason. For, there's no reason for it to be limited time. There really isn't. Gonna take a break for the night. Had an awesome time finally racing with y'all again. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Miscellaneous. Thank you for hanging out. I'm glad you had fun. Yeah, I feel like business-wise, Nintendo has kind of fallen off a little bit after uh, Awada passed away. I feel like Nintendo does a lot of shittier things now that I don't think that they would have done, like, maybe 10 years ago. Especially when you look at like companies like Microsoft, like I know Microsoft, I, I, obviously all companies are bad, right? Let's not simp for any fucking company, right? But uh, Microsoft with like, things like Game Pass and stuff like that, like they've definitely set a kind of a higher bar for like what we, we should be expecting from these developers. First place, baby. Here we go. First place and a mushroom for a blue shell dodge. Y'all, someone throw a blue shell at me. I want to dodge it. No, don't throw a red shell. That's not a blue shell. No, you fucked up my plans. You fucked up my content. I was going to get a sick ass blue shell dodge for the win. And you ruined it with your red shell. Mods, ban them. I thought I stopped my mushroom. Whoops. Ooh, we're getting a raid. Oh my god, y'all, we're getting a raid from Sora. Hey, what's up, Sora? Yo, thank you so much for the raid. The Otter Romp is here. I love that. I love the Otter Romp. I love that so much. Sora, welcome in. How are you doing? Welcome. Welcome into the stream, gamer. Welcome in, Raiders. How we all doing today? Moose Wrangler, Panda Bear. Welcome in, Ballerina. Majestic. Welcome, everybody. How we all doing today? We're playing some Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. If any of y'all gamers want to join, the room code is pinned on top of the Twitch chat. So feel free to join. We do got some spots in our lobby still. I'm going to go for about maybe 25 more minutes. Or 15, about 15, 20 more minutes. So you guys got some time for some more games. Yeah, I think so, Legend. I think they are. Like N N Nintendo, ha Nintendo hasn't like has gotten better over the years with some of their stuff because Nintendo, like as, with content creation, Nintendo used to be super fucking super uh, against like content creators, and they've like loosened up over the years. So there's still hope that they'll they'll you know do shit. How do you always call people by the part of their name they don't usually go by? I'm sorry. I don't know, man. I don't know. I just, I just guess. People call me Epic all the time, right? People call me Epic and like, I usually go by Dusk, but everyone always calls me Epic. You forgot the red shell dodge. Oh no. I keep forgetting to look at uh, Rachel's uh, me costume. Oh, there it is! Oh, you're Sonic! Oh! 
There it is. You're Sonic. I guess that's one of the me outfits. Yeah, probably for Smash, right? Sonic Smash me. Or not me, Amiibo, what they're called. It's funny, I enjoy it a lot. Well, I'm good. Call me Its, and I'll turn to dust. <laughs> Raiders? No thanks. I don't like football. Jack, 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 jack. Now, we got a raid over on Twitch, so for those who don't know, I stream on Twitch as well. I'm on Twitch and YouTube. That's right, I'm double dipping. Why not? Why not be on two platforms? Live a little. And we just got a raid from my friend Sora. What were you streaming today, Sora? What were you up to? America's with the death grip screeching. It's called soccer. I thought you were just talking about regular football because of the Raiders, the Los Angeles, or the, no, Las Vegas Raiders, yeah. They're, they're Las Vegas now. Not that I know, I don't watch football. Low key, sports are for nerds. Y'all ever think about that? All these nerds out here, like, mm, actually, if you look at the stats of this player, uh, they're, they're gonna perform this. Fucking nerds. That's some nerd shit. The roles have reversed now. It's now more nerdy to be into sports than it is to be into, like, I don't know, other stuff, like video games or whatever. Playing some Stardew Valley, nice. Classic. Some classic Stardew Valley. Oh, were you playing with uh were you playing with uh Solder? I know she was playing Stardew. Ooh, nice. Nice. No way this bullet just flew past me. I still call Solder Edge. You Edge Lord. I thought your name was Duck. Yeah, that's another one. A lot of people think I'm Epic Duck. Which I'm fine with that. I'm fine with Epic Duck. I like that. That'll be my second YouTube channel, Epic Duck. You're playing Finwin? Nice. Just in time, too, because we're going to play for about maybe 10, 15 more minutes, then I'm going to wrap things up. Get, you, get a couple games in with you. Did you know Michael Jordan spent a decade in the NBA to prepare himself for his role in Space Jam? <laughs> I'm the Iron Man. Yo, Rachel69, thank you for the follow. I'm gonna assume that's the racial that just came in from YouTube, so I'm not gonna, uh, I'm not gonna give you the spiel, unless you are brand new, in which case, welcome. Guess whose computer is being stupid and not loading Sea of Thieves? No! Cat dog, why?
Are y'all switching to Sea of Thieves? No, no, uh, we were playing it yesterday, and I'm, I'm kind of getting back into it. So Cathog was, was having some technical issues yesterday. It took her like two hours to get into the game. And I guess now she's having the same issues. I'm, I'm kind of like slowly getting back into Sea of Thieves. I, I want to try to play it more. I'm even playing with the idea of making a side channel for it. I got a video I'm working on right now. I don't know if I'm going to upload it to this channel or a side channel. I'm kind of thinking about it. If I do uh, make it into a side channel, I, I think I'm going to call the channel Epic Dawn. I can't think of a good, like, Sea of Thieves piratey name that's, like, incorporates Epic or Dusk. Besides, like, Epic Beard. But that's stupid. I don't like that name. That's kind of dumb. So I think I would do, uh, Epic Dawn. Just, that'd be my, my side channel name. They should make a Mario level like this, they should. This looks kind of like a Pikmin level, honestly, Pikmin 4. Pikmin 4 levels look really, like, really, uh, like, kind of exactly like this. Like, I always saw the planet, like, the Pikmin, I always thought about the planet is, like, abandoned. But in Pikmin 4, there's that one level that's, like, a pristine, like, clean house. So, like, Clearly, people are there. We should play some Pikmin 4 again, man. We should play that again. I love Pikmin. Would y'all mind if I just make a new Pikmin channel? I'll be a Pikmin tuber. You should just embrace Epic Duck. I should just embrace Epic Duck. I really should. Epic Tide? Epic Tide isn't bad. That's not a bad Sea of Thieves channel name. Epic Tide? That's not terrible. You'll have 5,000 channels by the end of time. I don't know why. I just, I love making channels, man. Even if I don't, like, ever go with the, like, like commit to them. I just like making new channels. It's just kind of fun. I want a Pikmin channel, I want an Animal Crossing channel, a Sonic channel, a Mario channel. I want I want a channel for everything. If YouTube would let me connect my channel members, that's the only thing that really holds me back. Because like I, I would hate to like grow a second channel and then like people who are membership to this channel don't get a membership to the other one. And that kind of sucks. If YouTube like will let you more like link your channels together, I think that'd be really fun. Epic doubloons. Doubloons! Dust collecting the infinity channels. Low key, if I was a full time YouTuber, I would definitely have multiple, like, more channels because I would have more time to commit to it. I don't want to spread myself too thin, which is why I don't do a million channels, but. I think it would be fun to, like, separate all the games into their own channels. Like, games that I'm going to make more than, like, five videos for. Because some games I just play once and that's it. So it's a one-and-done deal. But some games I want to really get into and, like, make a lot of challenges for and stuff like that. Blue shell. Take out the first place person.
It's okay, I'll keep paying money for the other channels. No, you aren't allowed to do that. I'm gonna call YouTube and make sure that they ban you from spending money. Oh my god, Wolfie with a $2 super chat. Bartender, here's my tip, have a good night. Wolfie, thank you, man. You didn't have to do that, you didn't have to give me a $2 super chat. I appreciate you, man, thank you so much for the support. You the best, man, thank you. And you have a wonderful night, man, take care. Whoa! Watch out. Don't fall off the map. Finish! We win! First place! Wow, amazing. I can't believe I got first- hang on one second, let me just, uh, let me just, uh, real quick. First place! Wow, amazing! Look at that, y'all! Top- top of the screen! So, obviously, I was first, right? Amazing! Look at them! Oh my god, amazing! Y'all, I can't believe I won. Look at that. I'm, I'm on top of the screen. I won. Hmm. It just struck midnight, which means I was supposed to end. I think we could do one more, though. Let's do one more. One more set of races, and then we'll call it a night. Just, just, just one more. When is tomorrow's stream? Uh, probably around the same time. Probably around like 5, 6 p.m. I'll have it scheduled when I figure it out exactly. It all depends on what time I get off of work. Because sometimes I get off work early and sometimes I get off late. That's the nice thing about doing the Amazon Flex stuff is if you finish early, you get to go home. But if you're running late, you gotta stay late. So it's like, I don't know specifically when I'm getting home. You got a shadow tattoo? That's cool. That's actually the second person who told me because of my shadow damn tier list. This is you're the second person that's told me that you have a shadow tattoo. That's cool. A lot of shadow tattoos out there. Especially now in the year of shadow. Y'all know it's the year of shadow. Alrighty, Coconut Mall. Bum 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 One last race, four last races. You can't do just one race. You go, you have to do them in bundles of four. So this is going to be four more races. These will be our final four races. So if anybody has not joined, but you want to, if you're thinking about it, you got four more races and then we're done. So you better join now or forever hold your peace. You're not playing this round with sister wanting to go? I'm playing against Timber right now. Oh, shit. Ooh. 
lightning strike. Kind of cringe. And boom. You said you want a bunny when she moves, right? I do want bunny. Is she moving? I don't know if I have a, a spot for her though. I don't think I have a, I don't have an available house. It would take me a minute to like do the time traveling thing to get like to get one ready. I think I have her amiibo, right? I think I'm fine, right? I think I have her amiibo. I can always invite her. I don't know if I do or maybe I maybe I should double check that, but Oh, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, she does. Let me know. Hi and bye. I'm tired. Good night, ducky. All right. I gotta cook. All right, Derek. Have fun. Cook up something delicious. Make sure you bring up enough for the whole chat. Yeah, that was a pretty good race. That was fun. We got three more. Three more races, y'all. By cooking, I mean winning this race. Oh, I thought you were actually going to go cook. Well, now I'm hungry, so... This is awkward. Oh my god, Rachel. What the hell? You did not have to drop a $10 super chat. Sorry, 10 pound super chat. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. I appreciate that so much, gamer. You didn't have to do all that. But I'm glad you're having fun. I'm glad you're enjoying the streams. Can't spell Rachel without a W. I mean, you can, but I see, I, I see your point. I see what you're going for. Well, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. That's super kind of you. I'm oh, broadcast this. You get your bike? Father's got her Dollar General key line pie. I know Dollar General gets like a lot of memes and shit, but like, I don't know, I kind of like them. They're better than Walmart, man. Walmart's really falling off. I, I have not had a good Walmart grocery run in like years. Every time I have to go to Walmart because everything else is closed, like it's a, a terrible time. Like Dollar General is not great, but it's not bad. It's pretty decent. And, and every Saturday you get the $5 coupon. That's basically, they, they, they basically pay you five bucks a week to shop there. If you think about it. That's 20 bucks a month. The Switch version has trophies online. No, there's no trophies or achievements on any Nintendo console. They're not. They're not really into that. It'd be cool if they did. If the Switch 2 gets announced and uh, they have like achievements, that'd be really cool. Oh, Rachel, you think you're so fucking slick, huh? Rachel, you think you're so clever dropping that blue shell? Do I trust Walmart steaks? Am I not supposed to? I don't really buy meat at Walmart though. I, I, I buy meat at Aldi. Aldi's got some pretty good meats. And they're pretty cheap. I do most of my grocery shopping at Aldi. It's just all these. I, I love Aldi, but they kind of suck because half the time, like, they're always out of something. They're never 100% stock. They're always out of something. So you gotta be going, like, every single day to make sure that you're not, like, you know, running low on your stuff. If you run out of something and you need to go to Aldi, like, you have to pray that they have it. Hmm. 
Oh, true. That wasn't you, Rachie. I'm sorry. I forgot you just said it was Timber. Well, tell Timber that she thinks she's so fucking clever then. Amazing. Are they really? I never heard about that. I also don't buy steaks though. I, I don't really like steaks. I, I like ground meat. I don't know if it's like a texture thing or like a whatever, but I, I I don't like like just huge slabs of meat. Any meat that I get, I get it ground and then I'm making it into like a flatbread or a tortilla uh, quesadilla or something. Or put it in pasta. I never just eat like a slab of steak. Why is everybody leaving? We still got a pretty decently sized lobby. I did say we're wrapping up though. These are gonna be our last, uh, these are our final two races we're about to do. And then I'm gonna call it a night for stream. So I can finish making that Sea of Thieves video and then get to bed so I can wake up and go deliver 20,000 packages. And give solder kisses, yes. Oh, okay. Heart-shaped Valentine. I, I don't think I've seen a heart-shaped Valentine steak at Walmart. I know Pizza Hut back when I worked there. They used to do the heart-shaped pizzas. That was annoying as fuck. Pizza Hut loves to do gimmicks. And I, it wasn't until I started working there that I realized like how bad it is for the employees. I remember they had that triple treat box and like folding those boxes was such a pain in the ass. And for what? Just for the gimmick of, oh look, it's a triple treat box. Like those items could have fit in regular ass boxes, but they wanted to do their cute little gimmick and it was fucking annoying. Didn't Pizza Hut do some promotion this year where they'll do your breakups for you? Like you can order your, your soon-to-be ex a pizza and like a Pizza Hut driver would tell them, hey, they're breaking up with you. I, I, if I was still working for Pizza Hut at that time and they were doing that, I would flat out not do it. Like, I'm sorry, but like, that seems like kind of like a bit of a dangerous thing. Like, I'm not going to be the one to break the bad news to somebody and what? They get mad and take it out on me? Methinks not. Methinks I will not do that. Matter of fact, I'll do the opposite. I'll, I'll deliver the pizza and be like, oh yeah, they just want to say they love you so much, they can't wait to see you. Then bam. How's that for an awkward, an awkward thing? That might be fake, but I, I think I saw I saw it like on, on TikTok or something. I don't know if it's fake or not. It kind of sounds like something they would do though. That's very like shock value. That's very like meme -y. That does kind of sound like on brand for them. They did a lot of stupid ass gimmicks like that. You got lucky. Nah, Rachel. All skill. No luck involved. All gamer skill. Her, I'm leaving you. Me, thanks for the free stuff, Crust. I don't know, the part of me thinks it's kind of a security issue for the driver. Like, I feel like, uh, I don't want to be the one to break up with somebody and then, like, what? Like, did they get mad at me? I don't know, it seems a little, a little risky.
Maybe I'm just paranoid. Maybe I'm just too afraid of people. I don't even like talking to customers while I'm doing my job, while I'm doing work. I do Amazon or Grubhub deliveries, depending on which day ha which day is like, paying better. I do like the apps, like Amazon Flex or Grubhub, whichever app is like doing better, I'll, I'll do. Lately, it's been Amazon a lot lately. And I'm always afraid to like call customers, because like I'm afraid like they're going to be like really like bitchy or pissy. And I'm, I, 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 don't, I don't handle conflict well. I'll cry. I'll break down and cry, man. Don't yell at me. Like, I'll be picking up an order at a restaurant, and then, like, they're out of the drink they order, so I'll call the customer, no answer, and it's like, fuck, now I, I already know I'm gonna just make a decision for you and leave, and the second I leave, you're gonna call and be like, um, if you bring me a Coke instead of a Pepsi, I'm going to kill you. And it's like, bruh, answer your phone then! Relatable. Dude, people literally like they'll order shit and then uh just like throw their phone away. Like I don't get it. Like with Amazon it makes sense because like you order Amazon like a week ago and like you're not like, waiting by your phone, right? That 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 makes more sense, but for Grubhub, you just placed the order, my dude. How are you already not answering your phone? I hate when they don't answer the phone on Amazon, though, because then it's like, the, the procedure is if you can't deliver it to, like, a, a pr approved place, you're supposed to take it back to the warehouse, but, like, that's adding so much more time to, to my shift. Like, frankly, I'm not doing it. Like, I'm sorry. This package is getting delivered one way or another. If I gotta throw it through your fucking window, then it's going through your goddamn window. I'm not driving all the way back to the warehouse just to give it back and let them try again later. GG's gamers, GG's. Went on a little bit of a ramble during that last race, a little work ramble. Well, alrighty gamers, I think we'll go ahead and wrap up the stream there. It was a fun Mario Kart stream, we played for about five hours. For food delivery, do you keep the food if the person order didn't accept it? If they don't accept it, yeah, I mean, I'm not gonna throw it away. I'll usually keep it or I'll eat it if it's good. Um, but with uh, with food delivery, normally you just leave it at the door. Like most people don't don't answer the door. They just put contact list. They just leave it at the door. So and if I if I ever like delivered food and like I, I knock on the door, they don't answer. I'll just leave it at the door. You are second at the start of the race. I'm taking that as a win. Hell yeah, gamer. Hell yeah. Yeah, I don't get free food as much since COVID. Pre-COVID, I would get free food kind of often, but after COVID, everyone just says to leave shit at the door, so. Which, I, I'm fine with that. I prefer that. I prefer minimal contact, even if there wasn't a pandemic. Well, all right, mates, guys. We're going to go ahead and wrap things up. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate that. Uh, Rachel, uh, thank you for your 10 pound super chat. Appreciate that. And then Wolfie also the $2 super chat and then FNAF me. If you're still here joining the membership club, appreciate that. Thank you all so much. We also got a couple of, uh, uh resubs on Twitch and a raid from Sora. Everybody. Thank you for that. Appreciate you guys so much. And I'll be back live again tomorrow because we're doing daily streams every single day in April as a celebration for 10k subs. So I'll be back tomorrow with some more gameplay. Don't know what we're going to play. I'll surprise y'all as always. Yeah, it was, good to be, it was good to have you here too, Rachel. Hope to see you soon. I'll see y'all on the next live. Y'all have a good night. Thank you for watching. And as always, stay epic, gamers.